Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Global Evolution. My explosion rate is 100 million points high. Chapter 71 Yu, the blade scratched across his neck, and Lu Wanzhong felt a coldness coming from it. He stared unwillingly, and then his body slowly fell backwards. He didn't expect that Yi Bai would be so cruel and wouldn't even give him a chance to commit suicide. But as he felt the vitality gradually leaving his body, all his resentment also disappeared. In this world, the winner has always been king. He had defeated many opponents before, but he also did not give those opponents a chance. Now, of course, he has nothing to complain about. Yi Bai looked at Lu Wanzhong's body lying on the ground. He didn't seem to be excited about getting revenge. He just breathed a sigh of relief and let go of a big stone in his heart. He wouldn't let Wang Zan kill Lu Wanzhong, so naturally he wouldn't allow him to commit suicide. One is because this is his main goal today, and he doesn't feel comfortable letting others kill him or letting Lu Wanzhong commit suicide himself. On the other hand, it was naturally because Lu Wanzhong had to be killed by himself before he could explode anything. And right now, kill one of the Awakeners and obtain the skill. Eight magic, which has been stored in the reserve space. The reminder sound of killing Lu Wanzhong suddenly came in his mind, interrupting his thoughts. Then his attention turned to the introduction of this ape magic. Ape magic. You can transform into the body of a demon ape by changing your body structure. After transforming into a demon ape, his body size will increase several times, and his body's attack and defense capabilities will be greatly improved. Note. Using this technique to transform into a demon ape will not cause you to lose your mind. That's right, I didn't expect that Lu Wanzhong would reveal such an awesome skill to me. It's a worthy death. After seeing it, Yi Bai's mood immediately improved a lot, and he couldn't help but nodded with satisfaction. Just by looking at the introduction, this ape magic makes people look forward to it. This reminded him a bit of the scene in Dragon Ball where the Saiyan transformed into a giant ape on a full moon night. After transforming into a giant ape, the Saiyan's destructive power can be said to be very amazing. Although his domestic ape magic may not be as powerful as the Saiyan's, fortunately, he can preserve his sanity and will not be unable to control himself. And he had an idea. That is, this ape magic technique can actually be used as one's own talent, transforming into a demon ape. This alone should be worthy of the name of Class A or even Class 3. Yi Bai took a look at the thing that had just been killed by Wang Zan, and it turned out to be a piece of spiritual jade. The introduction to this piece of spiritual jade is that if you carry it with you, it can enhance the speed of practicing certain techniques. Judging from this introduction, although ape magic is not allowed, it is not considered garbage. The things these three people exploded are pretty good. Yi Bai nodded, looking at the three corpses on the ground, he murmured, Give me a peach, and I will repay you with a plum. Then, he quickly picked up the corpses of Lu Wanzhong and the two Class A Awakeners from the yard, shook them hard, and threw them all into the villa. Finally, a fire burned down the whole villa. After doing all this, he took advantage of the darkness. Using speed, he quickly left the location of the Lu family villa complex. It was his last act of gentleness to prevent these three people from being exposed, and it was enough to destroy all traces of the scene. What a good boy, he's neat and tidy. Next, it's us, not far away from Lu's house, watching Yi Bai leave, Lin Shicheng waved his hand, letting the Lin family go in to deal with the aftermath. Work. This includes erasing all traces that may leave behind images, and getting rid of some people who are too closely related to Lu Wanzhong. For all this, Yi Bai only vaguely guessed that the Lin family was behind him, but he didn't know the specific operations. After leaving the Lu family, he did not return to his residence. Instead, after changing all his clothes, he came to a prosperous five-star hotel in Yuncheng as quickly as possible. This five-star hotel is 20 kilometers away from Lu's house, and it would take half an hour to get there even by car. However, Yi Bai arrived at the hotel lobby in just a few minutes at full speed. Before entering the hotel lobby, he quickly adjusted his breathing which became a little rapid due to running too fast. Hello, do you still have a suite? Then he walked to the front desk casually and asked casually. Hello, sir, please wait a moment, let me check for you. The beautiful waiter at the front desk glanced at Yi Bai, and her attitude became even better when she saw this very young man wearing a high-end suit. Yi Bai smiled slightly at her. 
Yes, sir, now we have three types of suites in our hotel, one is business suite, one is luxury suite, and the other is supreme. This smile made the little beauty's heart beat faster, and then she said respectfully replied. Want the most expensive one. Before she could finish her words, Yi Bai said with a smile. Ah, hello sir, our most expensive suite is the supreme suite. The price for one night is. The little beauty at the front desk couldn't help but be startled. Swipe your card. Yi Bai took out his bank card and said. In fact, he was not in a hurry, but just wanted to be bold and impress the other party. Although it is possible that he would not be able to trace the Lu family's affairs, he could create some alibi here just in case. After all, he was already more than 20 kilometers away from Lu's home. If outsiders didn't know his fastest speed, it would be hard to imagine that he would arrive here just a few minutes after killing Lu Wanzhong. Of course, it's not a big problem if he knows. The world has changed. With his current strength, as long as many things are acceptable on the surface and he doesn't do anything unscrupulous, the official will generally not pursue them to the end. Soon, the check-in procedure was completed in the shock of the little beauty at the front desk. After Yi Bai got the room card, he also asked the little beauty the time and arranged the entire process clearly. Of course, he did all this just in case. Even if it is unnecessary, he has never stayed in such a good hotel anyway. Now that he has money, it is not a bad idea to come and enjoy it. The elevator went up to the 33rd floor, and Yi Bai came to the Supreme Suite worth more than 30,000 yuan that night, well, it was only worth an ant. A suite already occupies half of the floor, and there is a special elevator. Only those who have booked the Supreme Suite can use it. After entering the room, the lights came on. The decoration inside can be said to be extremely luxurious. The most attractive thing is the floor-to-ceiling glass that takes up the entire outer wall of the living room. After he came in, the curtains opened automatically, and the entire cloud city could be overlooked through the floor-to-ceiling glass. Yi Bai stood in front of the window, looking into the distance, and seemed to vaguely see the fire rising from the Lu family's side. Gradually, he also calmed down. The rise of the Lu family is actually all due to Lu Wanzhong alone. Now that Lu Wanzhong, the leader, dies, the Lu family can be said to be completely finished. Even if they still want to survive, the other families in Yuncheng will definitely not let go of this opportunity to beat up the drowned dog. Therefore, on Yuncheng's side, he can be said to have no worries for the time being. However, he thought of another question. That is the Zhao family in Guangcheng. Although it is said that Seraph has been taken away by the Wushu Association and Zhao Tianhao has admitted that he is a coward, the results of the treatment have not yet come out, so he is still a little worried. Tomorrow's actions at Guangcheng Chimelong Wildlife World are of great importance. There should be high-level officials coming from the Wushu Association. Yi Bai's heart condensed, and he suddenly thought further. No matter what, he must get a result before entering the park. I stood in front of the window and watched for a while. Yi Bai took out his cell phone, turned on the camera, and took beautiful photos of the Supreme Suite, and also took a selfie of himself standing in front of the floor to ceiling glass. Finally, he typed, it is very high here and you can see very far. Then attached the hotel address and sent it to Moments. It's not that he wanted to show off, although it was his first time staying in such a high-end hotel, so it was understandable that he would show off. Mainly because I wanted to create some alibi for myself to appear more confident. Of course, if an older generation like Lin Chenkin and Lin Shicheng saw this, they would definitely laugh at him for being too young and naive, thinking things too simply. If the Wushu Association really wants to investigate, it is natural that these superficial things cannot be concealed. Lin Shicheng helped him with a lot of finishing work from behind. Coupled with the Lin family's relationship with the Wushu Association, tonight's incident can be treated as if it never happened. Comma. As soon as Yi Bai's circle of friends was posted, the likes and comments immediately went up all the way, reaching 100 in just a few minutes. Most of the comments were arrogant and envious, which was within Yi Bai's expectation. You know, he is now famous all over the country, and even Yi Shen's name is more popular than that of A list stars. He used to have so many classmates and friends, but now they all show off their connections. He was a little tired of dealing with them. Later, he didn't have many friends who had only normal relationships. Nowadays, it is rare for him to post to moments. 
Those classmates and friends who did not get a response immediately liked and commented, and then took a screenshot and posted it to moments themselves. In this regard, Yi Bai also turned a blind eye and let them go as long as they were not using it to cheat. After all, I am so awesome now. If I were my old self, I would probably want to borrow it to show off. It is not illegal for young people to show off. Brother Yi, you're so unkind, why don't you even ask me to stay in a five-star hotel? Mo Yuan was more direct and found him for a private chat as soon as he got there. Yi Bai smiled helplessly. He just wanted to reply, you don't have any money. Didn't you keep some of the 100 million given to you by the Zhao family before? Unexpectedly, Mo Yuan immediately made up his mind and added, no, didn't you meet your parents tonight? Hiss, could it be that after meeting your parents, you went to book a room with the school beauty? Hiss, it's progressing so fast. My brother Yi is awesome. As expected of you. Yi Bai, I really want it too but no one cares about me, so rude. Lines. At this time, his Xiao Qingwan was probably still studying and practicing the breathing method. Okay, don't think about it. If you have time, just practice the little thunder breathing technique I taught you. When you enter Chimalong Wildlife World tomorrow, I may not be able to take care of you all the time. In the end, he had no choice but to say angrily. Got it, you don't have to worry about me when you get inside. I'm born with a strong bone and won't get hurt that easily. Just protect my sister-in-law, Mo Yuan said with a smile. Yi Bai, I don't even bother to explain. After turning off Wei Xin, he threw the phone on the sofa, then walked to the bathroom and filled a bathtub of water. At the end of the night, after drinking so much wine, having a fight with Lin Qingfang, and then breaking into the Lu family's dragon pond and tiger's den, and then rushing here at high speed, I actually still felt a little tired not only physical but also mental tension. Now that everything was done, he felt relaxed. It was time to wash away the smell of sweat on his body. Soaking in the bathtub on the 33rd floor, looking out through the floor-to-ceiling glass. The dark clouds that originally blocked the bright moon gradually dispersed, leaving a clear sky, which seemed to make people feel better. By the way, he took stock of his current strength. In terms of practice, Little Thunder Breathing Method, Big Thunder Breathing Method. The two have a subordinate relationship. If you want to practice the Big Thunder Breathing Method, you must first practice the Little Thunder Breathing Method. In terms of skills, the Powerful Bull Demon Fist, the Subtle Body Method, and the Tiger's Roaring Golden Bell. Nine-fold Thunder Sword, Eight-Level Collapse Fist, Air Control Technique, and Three Arrows Fired in Unison. There is also the ape magic he just obtained from killing Lu Wanzhong, which can transform him into a demon ape, but he has not tried it yet. Weapons. Little Thunder Bow, Extraordinary Alloy Knife, Extraordinary Alloy Hammer. Armor. Extraordinary Alloy Shield. Golden Cicada Treasure Clothes and Golden Silkworm Treasure Clothes. He has studied the two, and it seems that their functions and defensive capabilities are similar, and they can only wear one, but there is an extra one. In terms of special items, a bottle of special healing medicine, a piece of spiritual jade, and an ancient bronze tripod. He took out the bronze tripod and observed it for a while while taking a bath. He didn't seem to find any use for it at the moment, so he put it back. In general, with so many skills and treasures, Yi Bai's current strength has reached a very terrifying stage. Of course, there is no need to say more about speed. The fastest speed can already reach 100 meters per second. In terms of strength, even a Class A physical awakener can hardly withstand his punch. Not to mention defense, with the tiger's roaring golden bell and the golden cicada's treasure clothes, he wouldn't be afraid even if he was besieged by Class A awakeners. Not to mention the ape magic, which can increase defense by turning into a demon ape when encountering an unbeatable one. Therefore, he felt that his life-saving ability should be sufficient for this trip to Chimalong Wildlife Park. But just in case, after taking a bath, he still called home and explained some things. Most of them were related to the Lin family. Before leaving, he would leave the two billion bank cards in the Lin family. If something really happened to him, he would have to ask the Lin family to hand them over to his parents. Of course, there must be certain risks in this, but the Lin family's reputation is much better than that of the Lu family, so they probably won't swallow his money, especially with his relationship with Lin Qingwan. Hang up the phone. 
Yi Bai stood in front of the floor-to-ceiling glass window, looking at the dying fire of Lu's house in the distance. He himself gradually calmed down, and the last cowardice in his heart completely dissipated. And move forward, as a man, you should be fearless and fight to the top. The next day comes soon. That night, Yi Bai slept quite comfortably. The large bed in the supreme suite of the five-star hotel is like a girl's skin, soft and elastic, and it feels wonderful to lie down on it. Of course, the most important thing is to solve Lu Wanzhong and eliminate the worries of the Lu family in Yuncheng. The mind is temporarily relaxed, and the quality of sleep will naturally be high. Get up early the next morning. Because the agreement was to meet at Lin's house at 6 o'clock, Yi Bai woke up before half past five. The curtains in front of the floor-to-ceiling glass window were opened. He woke up and sat on the bed in a daze for a while. Looking outside, he could just see the sun rising from the east. The slowly appearing red egg yolk illuminates the white fish belly on the horizon. The vitality of the morning is gradually awakened by the first ray of morning light. The location of this room is quite good. Let's rent it for a while. Seeing this, Yi Bai couldn't help but feel very good. After getting up, he first ordered breakfast service in the room. After he finished washing, the hotel's breakfast was delivered to the door. By the way, he paid one million and extended the room for another month. This amount of money was just a number to him before, but to him now, it is just a number. Money, that is the easiest thing in the world. This time he went to Chimalong Wildlife World to clear a dungeon. If he could return safely, he would probably earn at least 100 million or more. If you can't return safely, then the money will be even more meaningless. At home, in addition to the 2 billion he has not taken back, he actually left several million in his room last time he went back, as a spare for his parents. Therefore, you can spend it now if you need to, there is no need to be reluctant to part with it. After finishing breakfast, I looked at the time and saw that it was already 5.50. There are still 10 minutes of gathering time left. Yi Bai estimated that it was about 20 kilometers from the hotel to Lin's house, so this time was too much. He still had time to comb his hair into a handsome style. By 5.55, the sky outside was getting brighter. Let's go. Yellow Sand wears golden armor in a hundred battles, and Lulin will never return it until he breaks it. Yi Bai smiled crookedly at the handsome man in the mirror turned around and walked to the window, then put on his never-worn running shoes. Carrying an extraordinary alloy shield and an extraordinary alloy knife on his back. Open the window and door and jump lightly. Using the air control technique, he flew directly out of the 33rd floor and headed towards the Lin family. For him at this stage, the Lu family has fallen, and he has no enemies in Yuncheng. I'm not afraid of exposing my identity, so I can fly whenever I want. In terms of speed, it is actually slower than running on the ground. But flying can take a straight line, and five minutes is enough to reach Lin's house. Sure enough, at 5.59, Yi Bai arrived at the Lin family's helipad on time, and the helicopter was already in action. Lin Qingwan, Lin Qingfang, and Mo Yuan were also waiting there. In addition, there were two unknown awakened people and Lin Qingwan's third uncle Lin Xicheng seeing them off. The old man may be old, but he didn't appear here. But Yi Bai glanced at the sky and could still see Lin Chenkin's figure standing secretly in front of the window of a room in the Lin family mansion. It can be seen that this is a father following his children, and they are all a bit arrogant. Brother Yi, come here. Seeing Yi Bai arriving, Mo Yuan quickly waved his hand to the sky and shouted excitedly. Yi Bai made a leap and landed gracefully beside Lin Qingwan, beside Mo Yuan. Are you not injured? Lin Qingwan obviously knew about Yi Bai's incident last night, so she asked in a low voice as soon as Yi Bai arrived. Yes, you didn't come to me last night, and I felt a little hurt. Upon hearing this, Yi Bai knew that the Lin family was indeed helping him last night, so he smiled slightly and said relaxedly. I spent last night practicing the breathing method you gave me, and it was very effective. Lin Qingyuan raised her palm as she spoke and five small ice and snow lotus flowers were easily condensed on her green-white fingers. This means that her ability to control her talents has become more pure and refined. Not bad, Yi Bai nodded with satisfaction, feeling like he was watching his apprentice grow up. When he was in a good mood, he took out the golden silkworm clothes he got last night and handed it to Lin Qingwan, 
this is for you. What is this? Lin Qingwan took the golden silkworm treasure clothes, held it in her hand and touched it gently. She could feel the soft touch in it, but she had a feeling that this was a very tough material with a lot of strong defensive capabilities. Couple outfit. Yi Bai smiled, took Lin Qingwan's hand to his body and touched it. Under the outer coat, there was a piece of clothing with similar feel, warm in winter and cool in summer, insect-proof and snake-proof, invulnerable to bullets, very useful. What the hell, Brother Yi, what are you doing? Wasn't last night enough, Mo Yuan on the side said in his ear with a look of horror. Yi Bai wanted to kick this guy away. Lin Qingwan couldn't help but blush slightly, and then took out a bottle of rejuvenation pill and handed it to Yi Bai's hand and said, here is this for you. If you are injured, you can recover quickly. Yi Bai held the bottle and was startled. Isn't this the same one Lin Qingfang ate last night? He turned his head and glanced at Lin Qingfang, who was not far away. The latter turned his head proudly. In fact, he felt uncomfortable because the things he had managed to save and save for his sister were actually given away like this. But I couldn't say anything yet. Hum, do you still have this? Yi Bai took the rejuvenation pill. He understood that Lin Qingwan, a silly girl, didn't want to get his things in vain, but he was afraid that if the other party gave him the rejuvenation pill, he would lose it. In fact, he himself also broke out the healing elixir last night. There is another bottle, do you want it more? Lin Qingyuan took out another bottle. No, I'm afraid that if you give it to me, you'll lose it yourself. Yi Bai smiled. My brother still has it. Lin Qingyuan said softly. Do you think we have a pharmaceutical factory? At this moment, Lin Qingfeng's forehead was full of black lines, and he could hardly help but speak out, but seeing that Yi Bai didn't look greedy, he finally held back. What about me? This seems to be a good thing, do I have it? Mo Yuan from the side came over shamelessly. He really thought that the school beauty's family opened a pharmaceutical factory. Go, go, here's this for you, take it. Yi Bai thought for a moment, put away the rejuvenation pill, and gave Mo Yuan the healing medicine he had exploded last night. In fact, the effect of his own healing medicine should not be worse than that of the rejuvenation pill, but this rejuvenation pill is a gift given to him by his woman, so naturally he cannot pass it on to Mo Yuan. Is this also a healing medicine? Mo Yuan was just joining in the fun, but he didn't expect a surprise, and his eyes suddenly lit up. It's still special effects, Yi Bai said. Are you ready? Can we go now? Lin Qingfeng, a handsome boy who had been left aside for a long time, looked at a few people with a somewhat resentful look in his eyes, and finally couldn't help but speak up. Wait a minute, Yi Bai trotted up to Lin Shicheng who was seeing him off. Ha, huh. Lin Shicheng couldn't help but be a little surprised, thinking that what he did last night was exposed, and Yi Bai came here to express his thanks, so he smiled slightly and pretended to be ready to say no thank you. Third uncle, I have something to ask of you. Unexpectedly, Yi Bai handed him the envelope of two billion bank cards and related certification documents, and said, this is the compensation the Zhao family paid last night. We from Luopan town, if I can't come back this time, I hope that my third uncle can help bring me back to Luopan town. Hearing this, Lin Shicheng was startled again, then smiled and said, don't worry, with your strength you will definitely be able to return safely, I will keep this for you. Thank you, third uncle. Yi Bai also smiled slightly and said sincerely, thank you for what happened last night. Since it was the Lin family who took action last night, he felt that there was a high possibility that Lin Shicheng would take action. Why are you talking about this? We are one of our own. Lin Shicheng patted Yi Bai on the shoulder happily. He had been busy all night in vain and he still hadn't rested yet. Everything is done. The group of people boarded the helicopter. This helicopter is a medium-sized helicopter and can accommodate more than a dozen people inside. It is more than enough for them. The huge propeller rotated, and the surrounding dust flew up in whirlpools, and this behemoth began to slowly rise into the sky. The familiar white clouds of Yuncheng floated behind, and the plane flew towards the larger and broader Guangchang. That's Chimelong Wildlife World. After the plane flew for a while, everyone in the helicopter who was concentrating on practicing opened their eyes. Looking along the direction pointed by Lin Qingfeng, we saw huge high-voltage electricity towers, cutting the earth into a huge irregular quadrilateral. Outside was a bare isolation zone, 
but inside was densely covered with jungles, mountains, lakes and human beings. Buildings are also faintly visible. It's like a small isolated world. From the dilapidated buildings and facilities, it was easy to see that this small world was not very peaceful. Yi Bai could even see arcs appearing from time to time between the electricity towers. If you have any questions about Chimalong Wildlife World, just ask them. I'll try my best to answer them. Knowing a little more knowledge might save your life. Lin Qingfeng looked indifferent, but in fact, in order to pretend to be cool, he has spent the past few days in makeup lessons overnight. Brother, I have a question. These electric towers don't seem to be able to stop flying animals, right? Yi Bai raised his hand and asked. The problem is quite normal, but the title is a bit inappropriate. When Lin Qingfeng broke through the defense in one second, a slender hand silently landed on the soft flesh of Yi Bai's waist and exerted force. However, the elemental awakener's strength could not break Yi Bai's defense at all. Instead, he took the opportunity to grab the slender hand. Can let go. There is a mysterious magnetic field in the quadrilateral area. Any living thing or aircraft can only lift off about 100 meters. If it exceeds 100 meters, it will lose control and fall. This is also a very important point. People with the ability to fly should pay attention to the flying height. After being defeated again and again, Lin Qingfang could only explain in a low voice that he was not in the mood to show off now. However, Mo Yuan was not very discerning. He excitedly moved to the seat next to Lin Qingfang to ask questions, which made Lin Qingfang's head buzz, but he had to explain patiently. I didn't hear this guy say confidently, I'm such a good person, I can't suffer the loss of being uneducated. Fortunately, we reached our destination quickly. Guangcheng Wushu Association. There was no warm welcome as expected. The person who received them was an officer from the Guangcheng Wushu Association. He took the group to the place where they stayed and said, please come to the base to sign in at 8 o'clock every morning and evening before leaving. Because this is an almost nationwide operation, we still need to wait for people from other cities to arrive. Uncle, you, the vice president of the Yuncheng Martial Arts Association, are a bit hopeless. Yi Bai said teasingly. No matter how the world changes, only the strong can win the respect of others. Now, we will allocate room cards and gather at the base at 8 o'clock in the evening. Lin Qingfeng is very tolerant. No cards, no cards, but the treatment provided by the Guangcheng Wushu Association is still very good. Two people can be assigned a five-star room. Brother Yi is leaving. Mo Yuan took the room card and came over to greet Yi Bai. However, Yi Bai looked at him like a fool. What are you going for? Do you have any sense? You are single and I am not. I want to share a room with my wife. What's wrong with singles? Mo Yuan was not easily defeated. He turned around and looked into the crowd, walked up to a girl and asked, Sister, are you single too? The girl nodded. Mo Yuan was overjoyed and pulled the girl aside. I'm the weakest here, why don't we live in the same room? I can't do anything to you, right? What you said makes sense, but I'm a beauty addict, so I'd better forget it. The girl shook her head. Mo Yuan finally couldn't hold it back at this moment and cried in his heart. Ha ha, Yi Bai, who has developed hearing, couldn't hold back his laughter. Mo Yuan turned around and glared at his good brother, but he said harshly, I don't feel well, don't let anyone think about it. He shouted at the top of his lungs, What, brother Yi, you want to share a room with the campus beauty of Lin University? Yi Bai's smile disappeared immediately, and he felt a big trough in his heart. No, you can't share a room with Qing Yuan. Lin Qingfeng, who was getting the card issued, suddenly raised his head and locked eyes with Yi Bai. He couldn't defeat this wave, but he had to stop it. Let Yi Bai and Lin Qingwan live in the same room. What was the difference between this and pushing his sister into a pit of fire? The idiot Mo Yuan missed me. Yi Bai cursed in his heart and forced a smile on his face to argue. I want to share a room with Yi Bai. However, at this moment, a cold voice suddenly sounded. Aha, everyone's eyes suddenly fell on Lin Qingwan, and even Yi Bai had a look of disbelief on his face. Is this still the iceberg beauty he knew? But, this wave of Xiao Qingwan is high. It's not appropriate. You are not even engaged yet, so you have to sleep separately. Lin Qingfeng refused forcefully. I want to share a room with Yi Bai. Lin Qingyuan was more forceful. 
The two siblings stared at each other, refusing to give in. Seeing this, Yi Bai took action decisively. Hey, I've already met my parents, and I still call you uncle. Why is this inappropriate? By the way, uncle, even if you can't trust Qingyuan, can you still not trust my character? Lin Qingfeng wanted to say, yes, I just can't trust your character. But in front of outsiders, he still has to give face to the strongest awakened person in the country. After all, this also represents the face of the Yuncheng Martial Arts Association. He could only snort unwillingly, and then grabbed Mo Yuan who was watching the show, you don't have anyone to form a team with, right? I'll share a room with you, let's go. The two men left with resentment towards Yi Bai. Yi Bai wanted to give her a high five to say goodbye, but he still managed to calm down and greeted Lin Qingyuan with a smile, daughter-in-law, let's go. Lin Qingyuan was basically immune to the title of daughter-in-law, so she just nodded and walked in front. When Yi Bai came to their room, his eyes fell on the bed for the first time, and then he shouted in his heart that it was beautiful. It's a double bedroom. Hey, there is only one bed. This is a bit difficult. Yi Bai looked unlucky. When Lin Qingyuan saw that there was only one bed, her pretty face turned red, but she soon returned to normal. It's okay, the bed is big, let's do business first, shall we? Lin Qingyuan stared at Yi Bai longingly. Ah this. Yi Bai was a little confused. Xiao Qingyuan, you are so proactive, but you make me very passive. Before Yi Bai could answer, Lin Qingyuan pulled him onto the bed, and then. I have accumulated six things that I don't understand about Xiao Leyin's breathing method. Please help me explain. I'm about to take off my pants, you do this to me. When Yi Bai suddenly realized it, he also felt numb. This explanation explained that Yi Bai walked out of the room at the clock in time in the evening. The sign in place is at the base. The Guangcheng Wushu Association occupies a very large area, and the base occupies a full two-thirds of the area. It is not difficult to guess that this place is the top priority. This is also true. When Yi Bai and Lin Qingyuan arrived at the entrance of the base, they saw that the place was already packed with people. After some inquiring, I found out that people who are not permanent members of the Guangcheng Wushu Association can only enter the base four hours after signing in at eight o'clock in the morning and evening. Lin Qingyuan was always the bright spot wherever she was, and soon Mo Yuan and Lin Qingfeng came looking for her. Seeing Yi Bai's poor expression, Mo Yuan suddenly felt sad and said, Brother Yi, you have to be restrained. Is this person Yi Shen, the strongest awakener? I've seen the video, it's him. Ha, if you defeat Seraph, you are the strongest awakened person. Then the title of strongest awakened person is too worthless. It's also possible. I think Seraph may be a parallel import. The battle video just looks gorgeous. Maybe special effects have been added. Underestimate Yi Shen. You will die ugly. Comma. Mo Yuan's voice immediately attracted looks from all around. Yi Bai suddenly became energetic. Being able to come here, many of the people present are geniuses and outstanding figures in their respective places, so naturally it is not so easy to convince others. All of a sudden, the concealed or unconcealed sounds reached his ears. In response to this, he felt no fluctuation in his heart and even wanted to laugh. This group of people didn't come to challenge even if they were BB, so they lost if they were serious. But Yi Bai didn't care, which didn't mean Mo Yuan didn't care. How could he bear it when he saw his good brother being belittled? He pointed at the area with the most people and started scolding him, why are you so weird over there? I, brother Yi, am the strongest awakened person in the country. If you don't accept it, I'll go solo with him. You're not talking anymore. That's right, shut up. After Mo Yuan finished outputting the map cannon, he turned to Yi Bai and asked for credit. Brother Yi, look at my little brother, I've done a good job. As the saying goes, the Lord humiliates his ministers to death, how righteous is this? Ha ha, then I thank you. Yi Bai smiled, but not much. Now stay away from me. Why, oh, daughter they're really people who are not afraid of death. No need for Yi Bai to answer, Mo Yuan found the answer by himself. Several people in the crowd came this way, each one exuding a dangerous aura. Mo Yuan quickly hid next to Lin Qingyuan. This position is very good. Firstly, Lin Qingyuan is not weak and she can keep an eye on her. Secondly, if Lin Qingyuan is about to be attacked, her good brothers will definitely fight to save her. 
but Yi Bai still looked calm and composed, just looking at the four people walking towards him calmly. This was within his expectation. As the saying goes, there is no first in civility and no second in martial arts. There are so many powerful people in the country. Anyone with some strength is quite confident in himself and will not be outdone before a fight. Mo Yuan's voice is actually just speeding up, but he will encounter it sooner or later. The two men and two women stood still in front of them. They seemed to be no more than 30 years old, and they looked at Yi Bai in different ways. You don't look very strong, so I want to confirm, are you really Yi Shen? Ask the tallest man. The real strong man is not that he looks strong, but that you can't tell how strong he is. Yi Bai responded lightly, then looked up and down at the tall man in front of him, grinning and said, you look quite strong. Quote, the tall man was stunned for several seconds to figure out the logic behind Yi Bai's words, and said angrily on the spot, so you think you are better than me? Very good, I challenge you, do you dare to accept it? Yi Shen, I also intend to learn something from you. Don't get me wrong, this is not a challenge, it's just a discussion. Another man interrupted at the right time, very politely. Giggle, I have this idea too. Should the lady be given priority? My idea is very simple. If you can beat me, you will be number one in the country. The girl dressed in cyan hanfu covered her mouth and smiled, and even gave her a wink, if you can't beat it, then I'll join. This girl has a pretty face. Well, she can't be seen because of her loose hanfu, but it's enough to attract the prying eyes of a bunch of old perverts. Yi Bai glanced at Lin Qingwan and immediately acted serious. He ignored the other party and just looked at the last girl in a white dress. He waited for a few seconds before he couldn't help but say, why don't you say anything? Do you look down on me? I'm not interested in you, I'm interested in her. The girl in the dress looked at Lin Qingyuan intently, how about we have a fight? Lin Qingyuan obviously didn't expect that eating melon would hurt her. She was stunned for a moment and then smiled back, I'm not interested in fighting and killing. That's a shame, so I'll challenge you. It can be seen that the girl in the dress really feels pity, her eyes are not so hot anymore. Yi Bai could only shrug and said, you should sign up for me. I have some requirements for challengers. I can't accept all challenges from cats and dogs. Zhang Tianming, codenamed Terminator. The tall man. Wang Ran, codenamed Zar. A polite and handsome guy. My name is Wang Sha Sha, codenamed Thorn of Thorns, but I don't like this name. The little Lolita in Hanfu looked distressed. Han Fei, code name Dragon Girl. The girl in a dress. In a sense, the code name of the Awakened One is the most eye-catching internet celebrity nowadays. As soon as the code names of these four people came out, the scene suddenly became filled with exclamations and commotion. It turns out they are the five elements of Duin. The wood elementalist is so cute, I've been her crazy fan ever since. Among the five elementalists, Seraph is the strongest, right? He even had one of his arms cut off by Yi Shen, so the other elementalists can't even be beaten, right? You can't say that, Seraph is just one of the most slutty people on the internet. He has an account on Duin and posts videos every day. After all, this is an era that pays attention to packaging operations, so others think he is the strongest. In fact, the other four he is not weaker at all, even stronger. Just kill the strongest awakened person for me. Codename is God, you are so awesome. Haha, ha, you don't know how strong Yi Shen is. This title was not granted by himself, but by the people of the whole country. Everyone who has seen his battle knows that he is the strongest awakened person. I don't care if others come. Recognize. Comma. Yi Bai had naturally heard of the names of Duin's five elementalists. They were the five strongest elemental awakeners voted by Duin's good netizens. The gold element is the ultimate, the wood element is the thorn, the water element is the dragon girl, the fire element is the seraph, and the earth element is the czar. No wonder Long Nu is interested in Lin Qingwan, and her feelings are repulsive. Yi Bai looked at the time and saw that there were still 10 minutes left until the base clocked in. If he wanted to defeat the four people in front of him within this time, it would still be a bit of a time crunch. After all, it's not a life and death fight. We have to come one by one, and we have to use martial ethics to attack. I can accept your challenge, but I'm about to clock out. Yi Bai pointed out the key issues. The four Duin envoys were stunned. Time really didn't allow them to play a game. 
Just when they were about to make another appointment, they heard Yi Bai say again, the time is a bit tight at this point, and I guess you guys are embarrassed. Come together, then you should quickly discuss who comes first. The four of them were confused. What does time urgency mean? Does it mean that any one of us can be solved within 10 minutes? Don't be so insulting. Give me a chance, I'll do it. Zhang Tianming was so angry that he rushed towards Yi Bai without waiting for the other three to agree. Before the person arrives, the fist arrives first. Refreshing. You guys line up first, I'll be with you soon. Seeing this, Yi Bai smiled. He liked being so unreserved and could save a few minutes of time. The same unpretentious punch greeted him. Kang. The two fists collided with each other, making a dull sound like a heavy metal strike. The two of them were separated at the first touch, but the difference was that Zhang Tianming took a few steps back before standing still, while Yi Bai remained motionless on the spot. Did you awaken your talent for strength? Zhang Tianming looked surprised. Yi Bai grinned. What do you think? Okay, I'm going to use my innate ability. Zhang Tianming is a man of action. He clenched his fists and a metal blade grew out of thin air between his fingers. The blade had a sharp edge, which was extraordinary at first glance. This look is a clear tribute to Uncle Wolf. But obviously, Zhang Tianming's metal blade was more terrifying, because this guy flicked his hands in the air, and six blades whizzed towards Yi Bai. It's so fast that ordinary people can't catch it. Are the remote skills okay? But Yi Bai was in a hurry and just wanted him to hurry up. Now Yi Bai's combat experience is not comparable to that of ordinary awakened people. While his body quickly retreated, Xiao Lei Yin Bo was already in his hand. Not being an enemy, he didn't even bother to use arrows and simply drew the bow to eight points. Three arrows fired in unison. Gee, when three rays of lightning flashed out, he turned around and drew his bow gracefully. Three arrows fired in unison. The six rays of lightning were like precise guidance, hitting the six metal blades exactly. Bang bang bang, bang bang bang. The lightning shattered the flying blade, and he still had enough energy to fly towards Zhang Tianming. At this time, Zhang Tianming was a little confused, because in the past, most of his opponents chose to dodge his flying blades, and a few chose to fight hard, so that was the first step. Be prepared. Like Yi Bai, who used a temporary bow to fight back, this was the first time for a big girl to get on the sedan chair. Zila, let the lightning hit you and then dissipate. It doesn't hurt. But Zhang Tianming knew that it was not that Yi Bai's attack was ineffective, but that the lightning that hit him was at the end of its power. All this happened in a flash of lightning. Fortunately, the people present had good eyesight. They knew how terrifying the strength of both sides in the previous round of confrontation was, especially Yi Bai's reaction and counterattack were too fast and too fierce. This guy attacks faster and harder than me, and the attack range is probably further. It seems that I can only win in close combat. Zhang Tianming took a deep breath, his expression was already a little different. He looked at Yi Bai with caution. With such a great reputation, Wu Zushi, you are indeed very strong. I want to take it seriously. My attack may be a bit harsh, please bear with it. Yi Bai just looked relaxed, he hadn't warmed up yet. Ha ha, you think I rely on long-range attacks just like you. My strongest skills are melee combat and defense, so you'd better focus on it. Zhang Tianming showed a confident smile. Slowly, the smile disappeared, because his whole body was wrapped in metal. With the golden and red tones and the dazzling power device on his abdomen, it was not difficult to tell that this guy was a proper Marvel fan. Paying homage to Iron Man again. This is not the first time that Yi Bai has faced someone who has awakened the metal element, but Zhang Tianming is obviously different from ordinary glamorous people. This guy seems to be able to imitate metal. Terminator, this ability should be very difficult to die. Yi Bai nodded, which made him feel relieved. The bow and arrow in his hand disappeared, replaced by a knife, it's hard for me not to meet your request. However, just when Yi Bai was about to respect Zhang Tianming, there was a harsh explosion in the sky above his head. Looking up, he saw two figures falling from the sky. One old and one young. Many people present could recognize this young man. He was actually the strongest awakened person ever, Serif Zhao Mingyang. It's the messy hairstyle, the sad beard, the vicissitudes of life. Compared with doing videos, there are hundreds of millions of differences. I have something to talk to Yi Bai. 
Do you mind interrupting your competition? The old man asked with a smile. When someone interrupted the competition, Zhang Tianming had a bad temper, so he tolerated it on the spot, returned to his human form and stepped aside. The physical body can still fly so fast. This old man is a bit strong. The old man was very satisfied with Zhang Tianming's attitude and turned to look at Yi Bai, introducing myself, I am Zhang Kunlun, the vice president of the Wushu Association. I want to talk to you about Zhao Ming Yang. Usually when the management of the Wushu Association introduces themselves, they will say Wushu Association in X city and place, but this old man directly said Wushu Association. There is only one answer, he is the vice president of the General Wushu Association. A real boss level figure. What are you talking about? Yi Bai asked with a smile. In any era, it is a high voltage line for warriors to break the law. According to the trial of our Wushu Association, if Zhao Mingyang stepped on this high voltage line, he should be punished tonight. Zhang Kunlun said quietly, Hey, hey, just talk, what are you looking at us for? We are all good citizens, right? As soon as these words were said, the awakened people present generally understood what the vice president of the general association meant, and they all couldn't help but feel a chill running down their spines. This was a warning to them. But even if you ask for help at noon, you have to eat a bowl of decapitated rice first. Zhao Mingyang had a request before he died. He hoped to compete with you again, so I brought him here. Of course, you don't have to agree. This is just a formality. Zhang Kunlun's eyes returned to Yi Bai. At this time, Zhao Mingyang, who had gone through many vicissitudes of life, finally reacted. There was resentment and unwillingness in his eyes, but in the end, he locked onto Yi Bai with a burning gaze, provoking, Yi Bai. I admit what happened before, but I lost here you go, I am not convinced. If you are a man and you want to avenge the people of Luopan town, then accept my challenge. Do you dare to fight me again? Hearing this, Yi Bai couldn't help but sneer in his heart. He couldn't see such a low-end provocation. However, it happened that he really wanted to kill his enemy and commit suicide himself, but he might drop something good. Since it was delivered to his door, he would not refuse it. My shortcoming is that I am too soft-hearted. So he shook off the knife in his hand and said calmly, I cannot fail to meet the requirements of a dying man. In order to let you die clearly, I promised you. Seeing this, Zhang Kunlun couldn't help showing a hint of surprise. Logically speaking, Yi Bai had already defeated Seraph, and there would be no benefit in defeating him again. On the contrary, if he was defeated by Seraph who was dying, he would be in trouble with his grandma's family. Interesting. In that case, I'll leave it to you. Since Yi Bai agreed, he didn't have anything to say. He just nodded and stepped aside to watch the show. Okay, Yi Bai, I respect you as a man. Zhao Mingyang didn't expect Yi Bai to agree so quickly. When he came back to his senses, he laughed heartily, then come on, ha ha. Amidst the laughter, Zhao Mingyang burst into flames all over his body, and a pair of flame wings grew out of his back. Not only was it extremely windy, but it also made the scene heat up several degrees out of thin air, causing people who were close to him to retreat subconsciously. Han Fei hated fire and narrowed her eyes, Zhao Mingyang seems to have really become a lot stronger. Wang Shasha nodded, maybe it's a reflection of the past. Although Zhang Tianming and Wang Ran didn't admit it, the disdain in their eyes disappeared. This Zhao Mingyang was qualified to be as famous as them. Yi Bai, are you ready? Zhao Mingyang was full of fighting spirit. In this battle, he only died for dignity. Yi Bai said lightly, you should hurry up, it's almost 8 o'clock. Soon, you will respect me. Zhao Mingyang couldn't suppress his anger, and he flapped his wings lightly from behind and flew into the air. Then, in the eyes of many people in astonishment, the flame wings were getting bigger through constant vibration, and the surrounding air became hotter and hotter. What an exquisite control over the fire element. If Seraph has not committed a capital crime, this time it will be a blessing in disguise. Han Fei murmured to herself. By enhancing strength through elemental amplitude, Zhao Mingyang is already ahead of us in this regard. Wang Ran was slightly surprised. I can't beat him. Wang Sha Sha pouted. She was naturally restrained by Zhao Mingyang. Zhang Tianming kept staring at Yi Bai. This guy didn't strike first. He was clearly waiting for Zhao Mingyang to make the first move, and he didn't make any defensive moves. Pretending is a crime. 
Although the other melon eaters were not as clear as the four elemental masters, they could still tell that Zhao Mingyang was holding back his ultimate move. Mada, you are really trying your best. This kid has been hacked to death several times. He bullied me, Brother Yi, who is kind and amiable and doesn't talk about martial ethics. Mo Yuan never stopped complaining. Zhao Mingyang didn't stop until his pair of flame wings stopped vibrating. He stared closely, Zhao Mingyang's ultimate move was finally fully charged. Everyone thinks so. However, at this time, Zhao Mingyang opened his mouth and spit out a mouthful of blood. While everyone was stunned, the bright yellow flame suddenly turned into blood. The poor are afraid of the rough, the poor are afraid of the dumb, and the dumb are afraid of losing their lives. Now Zhao Mingyang just doesn't want his life. This is a desperate fight, this is a situation where everyone is dead anyway, and I want to drag Yi Bai to the bottom. Everyone felt that Yi Bai's challenge this time was too unthinking and dangerous. What the hell? Looking at the bloody angel in midair, Mo Yuan was so angry that he couldn't speak. What is this? Even if you hold back your ultimate move for so long, you still need to get a buff, right? Just treat me, Brother Yi, as a wooden dummy. School beauty, do you think Brother Yi can handle it? Mo Yuan turned around and asked. Lin Qingyuan just pursed her lips, I believe him. Well, facts are no longer the only thing that makes sense, only feelings are left. Mo Yuan stopped talking. Brother Ran, can you withstand Seraph's move head on? Coincidentally, Wang Shasha was also asking Wang Ran. To tell a horror story, these two are cousins. Zhang Tianming and Han Fei also looked at Wang Ran. The talents of the four elementalists each have their own merits, and they have a hint of restraint from the five elements, but the Tsar is the one who can withstand the most beating. Wang Ran didn't say anything, just looked at the blood and shook his head slightly. His intuition told him that he couldn't bear it. Oh, I can carry it. Zhang Tianming smiled proudly. The three of them looked at him, and then saw him saying again, I just don't guarantee that I won't die. I almost forgot, this guy is a tough talker. The three people's eyes returned to Seraph, and Han Fei made a judgment that everyone recognized, Yi Bai can only avoid this move, but Seraph can be considered decent. Half empty, Seraph felt his own state, with a look of fascination on his face. What a powerful force, if he could realize this state earlier, maybe he wouldn't indulge in wanton behavior, that is. Unfortunately, there is no if. He looked calmly at the flawless figure on the ground, thank you for not interrupting. Now, you can avoid it. He no longer had the idea of killing Yi Bai. He only wanted to save his strongest blow to prove to the world that Seraph had been here. Yi Bai smiled, come and try, see if I can hide. Good, before he finished speaking, Zhao Mingyang turned into a flaming meteor and rushed towards Yi Bai. No bells and whistles, the bloody angel's fatal blow. On the ground, Yi Bai narrowed his eyes and jumped up, facing the sea of fire with the extraordinary alloy knife in his hand. Hide, non-existent, a real man, upright. Enter the subtle body method. The figure is like a shadow, the last hair comes first. Swinging the knife like a full moon, purple light bursts out in blood. Ninefold thunder knife, quickly retreat. Zhang Kunlun, who had always been as steady as an old dog, now changed his expression. Is this the power that a, wild, awakened person can exert? Wind control. Then the old man suddenly stamped his feet, and strong winds arose from the ground, driving the people who had just reacted to the melon-eating crowd to accelerate back. A surprising group buff appears. Boom. Strong men like Zhang Tianming subconsciously looked up. At this time, they could no longer see anyone. They could only see a faint purple glow in the bloody sea of fire. When the other melon eaters reacted, they only had time to see the dispersing sea of blood. There is no doubt that Yi Bai looked down on life and death and did it head on. So, is he okay? How is that possible? The Hanfu Loli's mouth opened wide. She suspected that she had seen it wrong. However, the exclamations that followed one after another proved that her eyesight was indeed very good, better than everyone present. In the air, Yi Bai landed lightly, and the knife in his hand disappeared out of thin air. Chic and weird. Boom. Behind Yi Bai, a figure fell to the ground, it was His Excellency Seraph who was so majestic just now. The fallen position now looks like a broken sack. And once it fell to the ground, it became motionless. Obviously, 
he has changed from a generation of seraph to a dead chicken. Ding, kill one of the awakeners, and the proceeds from the kill have been stored in the reserve space. At the same time, a voice sounded in Yi Bai's mind. It's over, it's over now. The entire audience was silent for three seconds. Everyone looked at the audience, confused for a moment. This seraph was once the strongest in the country, but now he has been stacking buffs for so long before becoming the strongest in the country, but he can't survive even one move. This is too shameless. There is no life, Zhao Mingyang, dead. After a while, the little Lolita in Hanfu took the lead and spoke up with a trembling mouth. Is this still a human being? Everyone in the crowd was shocked. Not only did Yi Bai win head on, but he also killed Seraph with one strike. Are you sure this isn't playing on us? Well, it's impossible for Zhao Mingyang to take this kind of role. This is too scary. Looking at Zhao Mingyang's body, Zhang Tianming was almost moved to tears. Thank you for coming in time, otherwise Yi Bai's knife would have struck me. Seraph, my savior, have a safe journey. The attack was a bit heavy. Vice President, you won't blame me, right? Yi Bai didn't check what was revealed, he just looked at Zhang Kunlun with a smile and asked. How come, I want Zhao Mingyang to choose, and he will also choose to die by your knife? Zhang Kunlun shook his head, looked at Yi Bai, and said thoughtfully. Although both ways of dying are very frustrating. You can line up and punch in, please pay attention to order. Then, Zhang Kunlun walked towards the gate of the base with his hands behind his back, and naturally someone took care of Seraph's body. Yi Bai looked at Zhang Kunlun's back, and his mind was spinning. Although the vice president of the General Association only showed a little ability, he was already scary enough. Regarding the Awakened One, the fruit is indeed very profound. Let's go. Yi Bai greeted his companions and walked to the check-in point. Mo Yuan was stunned and shouted, Brother Yi, don't you want to line up? There are too many people, so we won't have to wait in line. Oh wow, Yi Bai and his group walked in a straight line, which was very rude, but everyone politely avoided them wherever they passed. Boss, you go first. This is the shock of strength. The scene where Seraph was instantly killed just now is still lingering in everyone's mind. Seeing Yi Bai, it is like seeing a monster or the god of death, and everyone can't avoid it. Even the four Duin Elements users who were extremely coquettish before are now all silent, and no one dares to press even half a sentence. However, there were enough check-in channels, and nearly 2,000 people quickly entered the base. From the outside, the base looks like a giant silkworm baby, with futuristic technology, but inside. Yi Bai just wanted to complain, is it because the decoration funds are not enough? It turned out to be rough inside. There were several huge screens hanging on the top, with a large banyan tree growing in the center, and many pillars as thick as a person's arms. Yi Bai didn't know how many there were, but these pillars were all numbered. He saw the number of a pillar as 2,333. Yi Shen, is this your first time coming to the base? A little Lolita in Hanfu came out next to her. Yes, Yi Bai replied casually, then noticed something and looked at her, are you a mixed race? Wang Shasha was stunned for a moment and said angrily, I am a direct descendant of the Langya Wang family, how can I be a mixed blood? Langya Wang family, Yi Bai always felt that he had heard it in some TV series, and it sounded very powerful. He pointed at the little Loli's eyes, then why are your eyes green? I am an awakener of the wood element. After awakening, my eyes change color. Wang Shasha rolled her eyes green. Is there a place for competition here? Let's just finish the challenge. Yi Bai asked again. Wang Shasha blinked her eyes and said, Oh, fighting and killing is so boring. I'd better introduce this base to you. There are many things here that are not accessible outside. Oh, okay. Yi Bai nodded. On the side, Wang Ran and the other two people were relieved of their nervousness. Fighting with Yi Bai at this time, can that be called a challenge? That's called seeking death. They never thought about not fighting. Now that Yi Bai is stronger than them, it doesn't mean that he will be the only one in a while. So, another day, have you seen these pillars? One person can sit on each one, and the cultivation speed is at least three times faster than outside. Wang Shasha pointed to the densely packed pillars. So smart, people who came to check in for the first time couldn't help but look at the pillars with green eyes. This is truly a cultivation accelerator. 
at least three times, that means some pillars are more than three times faster. Lin Qingyuan couldn't help but ask. When it comes to practicing, she is no longer sleepy. Hum, the closer the number is to the front, the faster the speed. It is said that column one can increase the speed by 20 times. 20 times, then we are not allowed to take off. How can I go to pillar one to practice? It's very simple. If you see the tree in the middle, put your hands on the trunk of the tree and meditate. If your image appears on any pillar, it means you can go up and practice. Then let's go. Lin Qingyuan took Yi Bai's hand and walked towards the big banyan tree. From a distance, it looks like a big banyan tree. From a closer look, it can only be said to be quite simulated. I don't know what kind of black technology product it is. Just as Wang Shasha said, someone put his hand on the trunk of the big banyan tree and meditated for about a minute and his image appeared on a pillar. I'll knock on the face recognition. Mo Yuanyu was frightened and couldn't help complaining. For social fear, the exposure of facial recognition is very embarrassing. It's none of your business. You're already in the late stages of social badass syndrome. Don't stand in the way. Wife, come and try. Yi Bai pushed his good brother away and signaled Lin Qingyuan to take action quickly. It was obvious that my wife couldn't wait. As expected, Lin Qingyuan did not hesitate. She stepped forward and put her hand on it. She thought about it for a while and then closed her eyes and started to use the Shaolin breathing technique. Sister Fei, how many pillars do you think she can activate? Wang Shasha asked Han Fei. In fact, the five elements of Duin, except for Serif Zhao Mingyang, the remaining four formed a small group. Their relationship is generally that Zhang Tianming likes Han Fei, Han Fei likes Wang Shasha, and Wang Shasha likes to play with flowers and plants. Wang Ran, he is Wang Shasha's cousin and likes to play in mud. Between the 20th and the 25th, Han Fei said firmly. Not everyone activates the same pillar every time. For example, pillars that have already been activated by someone cannot be used. Also, the one activated this time is number 10, and next time it may be number 8 or 9, or number 11 or 12. It's a bit volatile up and down. That's considered quite powerful among the top three talents. Wang Shasha nodded. Counting this time, this is the fourth time the four-person team has checked in. Han Fei's previous three results were number 10, number 9, and number 9. Zhang Tianming is about the same as Han Fei. Wang Shasha is hanging around number 15. Wang Ran is better. The best time was on the 6th. However, the slap in the face came so quickly. Just next door, a pillar suddenly glowed, attracting everyone's attention. That pillar showed Lin Qingwan's appearance, and the facial recognition technology that claimed to be showing her ID photo could not affect her beauty. But what everyone paid attention to at this time was not her beauty. Rather, the number of this column. Number 6. People who have been here know very well what this number represents. This is the first echelon of awakened people. And among these awakened ones, none of them are famous. But this girl is so strange. Number 6. When Lin Qingwan opened her eyes, she immediately showed a look of disappointment. She was imagining the first three pillars. Rounding it all off, she lost blood. Sister, don't be like this, number six is already very powerful. Wang Shasha jumped over and looked like she was about to cry. My best score is only number 13, and brother Ran's best score is the same as yours. Han Fei looked at Lin Qingwan steadily. Are you pretending to be a pig and eating the tiger? In her perception, Lin Qingwan was obviously not as powerful as her. What does it mean to pretend to be a pig and eat the tiger? Don't know. Lin Qingwan shook her head. She wanted to practice cultivation, but she still had some conscience. No, yes, yes. Anyway, she held back. Maybe it's because you guys are too cool. As we all know, Duin's per capita net worth is over 100 million, and the average per capita talent is top three. Yi Bai said with a smile. Wang Shasha's face turned red. You are talking nonsense, we are not parallel imports. Whether I'm talking nonsense or not, you'll find out later. Yi Bai kicked his good brother, you go and try. Okay, look at me. Mo Yuan's inexplicable self-confidence exploded. When he started to meditate, he never forgot to fantasize about awakening a pillar that could be used to show off. As a result, he really let him show off. 15th. No, this guy looks ordinary, 
but he can actually wake up pillar 15. I, I'm a little dissatisfied. By the way, he is Yi Shen's good brother, right? He can be Yi Shen's good brother, so it shouldn't be a bad idea. Comma. The crowd was blown away. Mo Yuan was so proud that he even raised his hands in all directions, saying that he was ashamed, and his performance was a bit abnormal. Pretend, I installed it for him. Wang Shasha pursed her lips, no, why? This person looks like a loser. How can I, the awakened person of the Langya Wang family, the first awakened lowly undoing, and the wood elementalist, one of the five elementalists, be equated with this person? This is unscientific. There must be a bug in the big banyan tree. Wang Shasha's face was full of dissatisfaction, and a minute later, she burst into tears. No, 16. I'm not as good as this rookie. Is it because of Xiao Leiyan? Lin Qingyuan pulled the corner of Yi Bai's clothes. The latter nodded affirmatively. When Lin Qingyuan's results came out, he had only initial doubts. Now that Mo Yuan's results came out, he was completely convinced. Do you want to try it? Lin Qingyuan looked at Yi Bai expectantly. Which man can withstand such a look? He nodded his head on the spot and said, I'll try. Swish, swish, swish. Now everyone around stopped and looked at Yi Bai. The best result so far was Wang Ran's number six pillar. Well, a good looking girl tied for first place. So, Yi Shen, who instantly killed Seraph, which pillar can he light up? The top five is still very stable. You still have to be ranked among the strongest awakened ones in the country, maybe the top three. What's the point of guessing like this? Let me guess which one it is at the beginning of the market. Hurry up and place your bet. 100,000 number. 3. 1 million number. 4. No. 690,000 too. Hey, how come you bet 690,000 and make up the whole sum? If you don't join in, do I just like 69 and don't give it to you? Comma. Originally, Yi Bai was about to put his hand on it, but when he heard the discussion among the gambling dogs over there, he was a little dissatisfied. He turned around and asked, Hey, don't any of you buy my number? 1. The promised noodles. Ha ha, Yi Shen, you don't know something right now. The president of the Guangcheng Association has said that private awakeners cannot activate Pillar 1, so our limit is Pillar 2. Zhang Tianming explained with a grin. The limit is two. This doesn't sound good. Yi Bai smiled, turned around and put his hand on the tree trunk. Limit. Does not exist. I'm making a fool of myself. This person is not found in the database. Please register and try again. Thank you. An emotionless mechanical voice sounded. Yi Bai. Everyone. No, you haven't registered with the Wushu Association yet. Lin Qingfeng shouted. Yi Bai looked back at him and nodded. It seems so. Vice President Yuncheng Lin felt the veins in his forehead throbbing. How old is this? The vegetable seller at the vegetable market would register with the Wushu Association when she had time. The key is, you are still the golden signature of our Yuncheng Wushu Association. My gold-lettered signboard is not registered. After saying this, all the dogs in the village laughed. Over there, hurry up and register. Vice President Lin glared at Yi Bai and pointed at the service point not far away. If this boy refused, he, he would not be alive today. Oh, Yi Bai showed respect to his uncle, turned around and walked to the service point. After all, he threatened death. Have a look, I'm very curious about what kind of talent he has. Wang Shasha shed tears and chased after him with her short legs. Behind him, a large number of people followed silently. What kind of talent has the strongest awakener in the country awakened? Even Yi Bai's. Pillow person, Lin Qingyuan is curious about this. There is only one staff member at the registration service point, who is playing with his mobile phone in every possible way boringly. After all, it is so late in the year and month, and even the vegetable seller in the vegetable market has registered. To be honest, he was even afraid of being fired by the base. Suddenly, everything went dark. When I looked up, I was shocked. Why are you looking at me with those green eyes? Isn't it just playing with your phone at work? Hello, I want to register. Ha, huh, oh oh. The staff member jumped up and then looked at the person who spoke. He looked familiar. Look carefully. Holy, Yi Shen, you didn't register. The staff member's eyes widened. No way. Yi Bai was also a little annoyed. Not registering doesn't break the law. 
how about you one by one? Okay, okay, ahem, I'll help you enter the basic information, and I'll ask you to answer. We all recommend telling the truth. Of course, you can tell lies. Our Wushu Association respects personal privacy very much. Quote. While the staff was typing on the computer, they were talking about formatting words that were engraved in their minds. Name. Ye Bai, you don't know me, do you? Ah, do you know? Dot age. 23. Comma. Place of registration of wishes. Whatever. Ah, let's go to Yuncheng. Codename. You can fill in three here. What's wrong with you? Ah, it's a bit of talent, ahem. Here comes the point. The onlookers cheered up. As we all know, the talent of an awakened person often determines his training direction and combat bias, which is very important for studying a person. The strongest awakened person in the country is worth studying. Beast transformation. Oh, animal transformation. Many people were stunned at the same time, and then they were stunned. Animalization. You lied to a three-year-old child. No, you can't fool a three-year-old. Yi Shen, what's the matter? You can't fill in false information for talent, because we have to record a demonstration of your talent and skills. If the goods are not correct, the registration will not be successful. A weak reminder from the staff. Yi Bai's eyes widened. Who filled in the false information? My talent is animal transformation, fill it in for me. Okay, okay. Yi Shen's pressure was too great, and the staff finally gave in and locked the option of animal transformation in the column marked with focus. Then he stood up with a heavy heart and pointed to the stage next to him, now you have to record your talent. You can show it for 30 seconds to 2 minutes. Please show your best condition as much as possible. This video will determine your official status. Talent rating. After saying that, the staff couldn't help but close their eyes. She could already imagine the next scene. Yi Shen took out the weird-looking knife and slashed the stage with one blow. Both the input system and him, the on-site observer, concluded that the goods were not correct and asked the registrant to re-register, and then. There's no after that, it's quite easy to register. Yi Bai smiled and jumped onto the stage. Then, he didn't take out the knife. Instead, he stood in a daze for a moment, and then shouted loudly, transform into a beast. Wow, you can really act. The melon eaters were too lazy to look. However, in the next second, everyone's eyes suddenly widened and their mouths opened wider and wider. Stab. Yi Bai's clothes exploded. The young man, who was over one meter tall, suddenly grew to three meters tall. His whole body was covered with black and shiny hair, and his roots shone with a dangerous aura. Except for his face, the face at this time was no longer Yi Bai's. The harmless face of humans and animals was replaced by a ferocious monkey face. This is not an adjective, it is a real monkey face. Boom, boom, boom. The three-meter ape walked to the edge of the stage, looked down at the service staff and grinned, look, is this animal transformation? The service staff couldn't help but stepped back, and then tripped over his left foot. Hey, talk. The big ape spoke again. The service staff just woke up from a dream and hurriedly got up and nodded wildly, it's a beast, it's too beast, it's almost a beast. Beast transformation is a popular talent, but most people's beast transformation is only partial beast transformation. For example, Uncle Shang in Yebai village can transform into a bear paw to fight. A person like Yi Bai, with his hair, ears, face, and yes, his teeth that can bite a child in his mouth, is completely transformed into a beast. He is one of the rare beast transformers. Anyway, it's great, but everyone at the scene still had 10,000 grass and mud horses galloping past in their minds. No, that Yi Shen was so elegant that he could fly into the sky, and his sword and bow fighting skills were unparalleled. He was suspected of being an awakener of the thunder element. His talent is actually animal transformation. What a nonsense. But whether they believe it or not, anyway, they have to believe it. The facts are right in front of you. What level can my talent be rated at? Yi Bai asked again. He was naturally in the demon ape state at the moment. This was his first time using this skill, but there was nothing uncomfortable about it. Because compared to usual times, I am taller, stronger, and have better teeth. I kind of want to eat peaches and bananas. Rounding things off is similar to being a human being. You can show it again so that we can identify it better. A voice answered on behalf of the service staff. Everyone looked and saw, 
Good guys, the vice president of the General Association has come to eat. Zhang Kunlun had a look of surprise on his face. He couldn't accept the fact that Yi Bai was talented in animal transformation, so he decided to take another look. That's okay. I'll only perform once, so you can watch it. Yi Bai followed suit. After all, he had already decided that from now on he would be an upright, awakened beast. Anyone who says otherwise will be beaten to death. Returning to the center of the stage, Yi Bai decided to try his own strength. As we all know, animal transformation is mainly about the increase of strength. So after thinking about it for a while, he stamped his foot hard. Boom! The stage collapsed in disgrace. Smoke and dust were everywhere, and all kinds of equipment were in bad luck. Zhang Kunlun's face trembled, and he waved his hand to disperse the smoke. Then he saw the big ape standing on the ruins, scratching the back of his head and looking at him in confusion. The quality of the facilities of your Wushu Association is too bad. The service staff wanted to tell Yi Bai that this test bench was made of super alloy material and the floor was made of new load bearing rock, which could easily withstand impacts of several tons. But Zhang Kunlun didn't want to explain anything, he just urged to continue entering the information. In the end, Yi Bai's talent rating column was naturally top three. Brother Yi, try activating the pillar. Mo Yuan couldn't wait to watch his brother show off. Even though I'm such a good person, I can be called number 15, but Yi Bai must be number 1. Yi Bai had this intention and walked towards the big banyan tree on the spot, but soon he realized something and turned his head to look at the crowd. Does any of you know where the toilet is? I need to pee. Everyone, there's a tent over there. Zhang Kunlun noticed something and pointed to the innermost part of the base. It was the Wushu Association's office at the base, and it was considered a confidential place, but Zhang Kunlun decisively let Yi Bai use it. Because all the toilets in the entire base cannot accommodate his body that is more than three meters tall. Yi Bai left quickly and came back quickly. Having regained his human appearance, he walked out wearing a new luxury brand. Not only did he not look embarrassed, he seemed to be two points more handsome than before. Where did this dress come from? It's so confusing. As fascinating as his talent. But if Yi Bai doesn't confess, there's nothing you can do against him. There's no need to arrest him and slice him up for study. Now Yi Bai is in the national spotlight. Anyone who makes any move will be watched. Moreover, there is a mysterious awakened person in the country. In fact, for it's a good thing for the country as a whole. The moment of slap in the face finally came. Soon, the president of the Guangcheng Martial Arts Association announced in public that the civil awakeners could not activate pillar number one, but Yi Bai ruthlessly overturned it. Still the kind of slap in the face. Just ten seconds after Yi Bai Gang put his hand on it, his image appeared on the pillar number one closest to the big banyan tree. It was like the difference between a 10,000 yuan computer and a 1,000 yuan computer. It started up very fast. Regarding this result, the people who eat melons are no longer so surprised. Yi Shen, the awakened beast turned ape, now he flew up directly without climbing the pillar, which is very reasonable. What? Never seen a monkey fly. The monkey king was eaten by you. Practice, you can catch up. Zhang Tianming was still arrogant. The others didn't say anything and silently opened the pillars. They didn't say whether they could catch up or not. They definitely needed to practice. This was a rare opportunity. But just when they were about to go up to their respective pillars, a figure fell from the sky again. Yi Bai, what happened? Why are you back again? Mo Yuan asked in surprise. Yi Bai sighed. Cultivation up here won't help me much, it's boring. How is it possible? Can't Pillar 1 be accelerated 20 times? Everyone was confused. Well, Yi Bai thought about it seriously and then said, Scientifically speaking, the above can indeed speed up 20 times, but it has no effect on me. To be completely honest, he had already determined that his techniques and various skills would make progress naturally without any practice at all. In other words, he already had his own accelerator. So it is very reasonable that when two accelerators are turned on at the same time, there will be no superposition effect, but only the one with the strongest acceleration will have the effect. Oh, everyone suddenly realized that this person was unscientific. What's the matter with suddenly not wanting to practice and wanting to lie down? Xiao Qingwan, go up and practice. Don't waste it if you have it open. Yi Bai looked at Lin Qingwan with a smile. 
The latter's bright eyes shone slightly and she nodded. She did not choose the inelegant plan of climbing a pillar, but walked casually, with ice forming on the soles of her feet forming an upward ice ladder. Sister Lin, can you lend me your number six pillar? Wang Shasha shouted from below. Okay. Lin Qingyuan's voice came from above. Great. Wang Shasha jumped three feet high and headed straight for pillar no. Six. Lin Qingfeng and Mo Yuan had something to say, but they couldn't say it. They couldn't compete with a little Lolita, right? Mo Yuan was better. After all, his pillar was not bad, so he turned around and climbed away. Seeing Mo Yuan crawling, Lin Qingfeng looked at Yi Bai sideways. Others didn't understand, so he didn't understand. It must be related to Yi Bai. Want to learn? I'll teach you later. Yi Bai grinned. Lin Qingfeng was overjoyed and slapped Yi Bai on the shoulder. I really saw you right, my good brother in law. The huge crowd quickly dispersed. Nothing is more important than becoming stronger. The Guangcheng base will undoubtedly be of great help to them. They cannot be sorry for the country's cultivation. Yi Bai has no use for this cultivation, and he doesn't want to practice because he already practiced in the room during the day and felt a little nauseous. Balance between work and rest is important. He walked around the base, and then felt lonely. Besides pillars, there are pillars. I simply looked through the portable space and remembered hearing a few sounds after killing Zhao Mingyang, but I was just pretending to be cool and forgot to check. Seraph was a little trick, and actually exploded with a lighter, which is the kind of lighter in traditional understanding, and it is not windproof. Fortunately, three items were exploded in total, and Yi Bai was very satisfied with the remaining two items. One is the Extraordinary Alloy Stick. Although it belongs to the same series as the Extraordinary Alloy Knife and Extraordinary Alloy Hammer, the materials used for this thing are obviously much more luxurious. The thighs are thick and one foot long. I wonder how big it is. It is simply a weapon tailor made for the demon ape state. Finally, there is the Madness Potion, a one-time consumable item that can explode to 300% strength within 2 hours after swallowing it, and will be weak for 24 hours afterwards. This thing is not usually used, but it can be used as a life-saving trump card. By the way, when you go out, you still need to step on more cockroaches, ants, and so on, or burst out more clothes, because the beast-shaped demon ape can burst out of clothes. Yee bai, yee bai who was taking stock of his inventory, was startled. When he turned around, he saw Zhang Kunlun looking at him with a smile. What's up? Yi Bai was wary, the old man's eyes were a bit unscrupulous. What do you think of the current global trend? Zhang Kunlun was also very down to earth and casually sat down next to Yi Bai. Both of them sat on the ground. This made the situation so big from the beginning. Yi Bai thought about it seriously and replied seriously. I feel that money is not very valuable. Mr. Zhang, do you think I should exchange the money for other assets? This will be more risk-resistant. Zhang Kunlun's smile froze. I have such a big picture. Why are you talking to me about your little savings? All aspects that have been impacted after the great change should be resolved within the next six months. Countries around the world are in emergency consultations to focus on solving various issues including currency, law, and the division of the strength of the awakened ones. By the way, it may be possible by then we also need you to contribute to our country. Zhang Kunlun was indeed prepared, he opened his mouth and brought the topic back. I'm just an ordinary awakened beast, how can I help? Yi Bai looked very scared. Chapter 81 You're just mediocre. Can your acting skills be any worse? Zhang Kunlun wanted to curse, but in the end he could only look at the ceiling with a melancholy face. He couldn't understand how a young man in his twenties could have 800 evil thoughts. How can we communicate like this? And soon, Yi Bai also cursed and left the base, also scolding him secretly. The old man's chicken blood is a beating, and the pie is one piece after another, but it doesn't give any actual benefits, bah. Returning to the hotel was a bit of a struggle. For others, the base is an opportunity, but for Yi Bai, it is worse than useless. And this kind of life will last for two days, and he can only scroll through doing in boredom. Nowadays, major video platforms seem to have a mission. Every video without the word, awakened, is like breaking the law. Anyway, there are all kinds of, awakened, news. And he, the most powerful awakened person in the country, is undoubtedly a word that appears frequently. 
The current to one on the popular doing list is, outrageous, Yi Shen is actually the awakened beast. Click on the account of a major media organization, and the content is exactly the high-definition video of him showing off his talents. The copy states that the media spent millions to exclusively obtain the video. Look at the angle and distance of the shooting. Mud, there is a mole. I casually clicked on the comment section and, well, it's already blown up. 80% of people are questioning, 10% of people are licking the screen, and 10% of people discussing how the indescribable great ape parts are invisible. There are two groups here. One group believes that this is an incomplete animal transformation, and the other group is sure that this is a female ape that has transformed into an animal. Then another group of sunspots appeared, and they categorically stated that this was Xiao. Slander. Yi Bai couldn't bear it anymore and went directly to the big room to talk. I am fully transformed into a beast, but I can control part of myself from becoming a beast, that's it. Yi Shen. Watch again in 10 minutes. Such slanderous remarks against him have ceased, and instead, everyone praises him as a civilized beastly awakener. A few days passed like this. The Guangcheng Martial Arts Association is gathering more and more awakened people, and there are already so many that there are not enough beds. Thousands of people are crowded into tents in the open space outside. The Guangcheng Martial Arts Association is fair. In order to allow the later awakened people to enjoy the feeling of cheating, they directly cut the time for the previous awakened people to enter the base, changing the check-in time from 8 o'clock in the morning to 8 o'clock in the morning or 8 o'clock in the evening. Yi Bai also clocks in on time every day, nothing more than opening a number one machine for his wife. Even if the time is shortened, the progress of those who are in the first echelon of talent is still exaggerated. For example, Yi Bai's good brother Mo Yuan has broken away from the status of a rookie, and his strength has reached above the average among the nearly 10,000 awakened people. Lin Qingfeng put aside the basic training methods and modified Xiao Lian's breathing method, and his strength gradually increased. In the same batch of check-in teams, he could confidently make Yi Bai, Lin Qingwan, and Duin Si stand up, and then yell that I am not targeting anyone, everyone here is rubbish. The four Duin envoys do not have the little lay in breathing technique, but what they practice is obviously not a basic textbook. Now they are confident that they can be evenly matched with the explosive serif. Of course, if you want to say who has made the most terrifying progress, it must be Lin Qingwan of Unit 1. How does it reflect her current level? Han Fei and her secretly went outside to compete. No one knew who won and who lost, but the two came back holding hands, talking and laughing. At 8 o'clock that morning, Yi Bai walked into the base yawning and was about to turn on his computer. At this time, a rich voice sounded. Those whose names are called are asked to gather at the entrance of the base within 10 minutes. Those who did not hear clearly can check the list on the big screen. No waiting will be done after the deadline. Yi Bai, Lin Qingwan, Wang Ran. Anyone who has some understanding will be refreshed at this time, and they are finally ready to work. Yi Shen was the first to shout, card. The names in front are all on the cards. Wait, is it possible that the Guangcheng Wushu Association still selects people to join? Nonsense, with so many people there must be a winner among the best. Oh my god, it's not scary to pick someone, whoever doesn't pick will be embarrassed. Don't make any noise, my name is complicated, so you have to listen carefully. Really, brother, what's your name? Zhang Wei. Quote dot dot dot, my name is also Zhang Wei. The person whose name was called walked out with his head held high. Many people can't wait, their strength has increased a bit quickly in the past few days, and they need to be consolidated through actual combat. When we got to the open space outside, we saw three big guys waiting there. Zhang Kunlun, the vice president of the General Association, was not standing in the middle. The one standing in the middle was a middle-aged handsome guy, in his forties, with sharp eyes and a vague aura of a strong man. Uncle Kui, Wang Shasha shouted. The handsome middle-aged man looked over, smiled and nodded, but said nothing. Who is Shasha? She looks awesome. Mo Yuan couldn't help but ask. What do you mean by looks? Uncle Kui is really awesome. Wang Shasha glared at Mo Yuan, she was always worried about the fact that this guy was the same level of awakener as herself. But he continued to explain. He is Kui Shan, the president of the Guangcheng Martial Arts Association, and he is also the head of the Bolin Kui family. Oh, 
It just means you have a high status. Mo Yuan didn't seem to care very much, he had been swollen recently. Wang Shasha looked at him disdainfully. We bundled together or not enough for Uncle Kui to take care of. TCH, bragging. Mo Yuan didn't believe it. In his opinion, a few people nearby could beat Yi Bai even if they were tied together. How could they not beat Kui Shan? My good brother is the strongest awakened person in the country. How to say, ignorant people or fearless. Yi Bai squinted his eyes and looked at Kui Shan, and he smelled a bit of danger in this uncle. Sure enough, the water for awakened people is still very deep, and the four Duin messengers are only for the general public to see. Think about it, this is a state machine, what kind of evildoer can't find those who have awakened talents? What kind of resources cannot be used? What kind of information is not obtained first? Just look at Guangcheng's base and you will know a thing or two, just cheat. But Yi Bai didn't belittle himself, who was afraid of who when it came to cheating. His strength is also for others to see. Who actually knows how strong he is? The situation is open, and sooner or later the strongest awakened person in mankind will be mine. He said ten minutes, ten minutes. When the time was up, Kui Shan looked at the huge crowd and spoke. I am Kui Shan, president of the Guangcheng Martial Arts Association. First of all, congratulations to all of you for obtaining the qualifications to enter Chimelong Wildlife World. We will enter when the sun is hottest at noon. Of course, you can choose not to enter. The crowd was in commotion. Someone asked, President Kui, do those who don't want to go in and those who are not selected have to leave here? The entry of large-scale awakened people into the Chimelong wildlife world will definitely cause a riot among the mutated creatures inside. The remaining people can assist the association in guarding the border. The reward is that for every number of hours of defense, they can enter the base for that many hours. Kui Shan explained calmly. Everyone suddenly realized that the elite were responsible for the attack and the rest were responsible for the defense. The offense is dangerous and the defense is threatening, but not much. President Kui, what can you get if you go in? At this moment, a slightly cold voice suddenly sounded, overpowering the discussion. Many people then realized, yes, the remuneration on the defensive end is so exciting, so why shouldn't the remuneration on the offensive end take off? So they also asked, but Kui Shanhei's answer was unclear. He just said that in addition to enjoying the same treatment as the defensive end, the harvest in Chimelong wildlife world also belongs to the individual. Finally, there will be additional rewards for individual outstanding players. What are the standards for individual excellence? What's the extra bonus? No matter how many people asked, President Kui was stunned and covered his head tightly. However, just one more harvest that belongs to one person is enough to satisfy this group of awakened people. Many of them come here for the resources in Chimelong Wildlife World. Yi Bai didn't care about the treatment issue. He just wanted to be a ruthless monster blasting machine, but the cold voice just now attracted his attention. Then, he discovered a group of very special people. The appearance of this group of people spans three generations, old, middle and young. There is nothing special about them, but if you observe carefully, it is not difficult to find that the eyes of these people will reveal a temperament from time to time. Arrogant, the cold voice just now was made by one of them. Yi Bai continued to observe and found some people with similar temperaments in the crowd, but the scale was not so large, and most of them were in groups of three or five. Someone noticed Yi Bai's gaze and even smiled at him. That smile reminded Yi Bai of Lu Jinghui. When he introduced himself at the beginning of school, this kid used this smile to look at the classmates in the audience, giving him an inexplicable sense of superiority. President, there are 1,333 people. Have someone count the number of people on the offensive end. Kui Shan was very satisfied with this number. The original plan was to recruit an elite group of a thousand people, but now there are more than 300 more people. The mutated creatures inside are very sensitive now. Large-scale entry can easily trigger a tide of beasts, so we will use the tactic of dividing them into parts and put about 300 people in every 30 minutes starting from 12 o'clock. Now you can freely form teams. There is no limit to the number of people in each team, but the maximum number cannot exceed 20 people. You have one hour. After forming a team, you can come and receive the positioning bracelets. We will distribute them in the order of the bracelet numbers. As Kui Shanhei's voices sounded, the crowd became chaotic again. 
Many people did not expect that they were fighting in small teams and thought they were going to fight a large group of thousands of people. Yi Bai, are we recruiting at full capacity, or is this enough? Lin Qingfeng approached Yi Bai to ask. More than 30 awakened people came to Yuncheng, but only less than one third were selected. Counting Yi Bai, there were exactly 10 people. Lin Qingfeng thought it would be better to recruit 20 people. After all, more people are more powerful. Even if you can't outrun mutant creatures when encountering danger, you can always outrun your teammates, right? In short, the benefits outweigh the disadvantages. Of course, Yi Bai didn't see it that way. If he recruited 10 more people into the team, wouldn't that mean he would be divided against himself? I think this is good. Yi Bai suggested seriously. Seeing that the absolute core of the team disagreed, Lin Qingfeng, the nominal captain, could only say, Okay, it is risky to team up with unfamiliar people, but it is good to be your own team. What if an acquaintance wants to join the team? A playful voice came from behind. Lin Qingfeng blurted out, That's no problem. Okay, then the four of us will join your team. Only then did Lin Qingfeng react. When he turned around, he saw two men and two women walking towards him with smiles on their faces. Let me knock, what are the four elements of doing? Lin Qingfeng was stunned for a moment and couldn't help but look at Yi Bai again, what do you think? Don't any of you want it? Yi Bai asked, of course someone wants it. Yi Shen, what are you talking about? But we feel that with Yi Shen, your team, um, will feel safer, so we came here to join us. Wang Shasha looked like a girl obsessed with girls. I believe your ghost. Yi Bai was complaining in his heart, but a bright smile appeared on his face then welcome the four masters to join the team. I want to see what tricks you are going to play. In the end, the team was quickly formed into 14 people. Yi Bai personally named the strongest team on the surface, and team leader Lin Qingfeng received the positioning ring immediately. Comma. At noon, the first group of people to be released rode military trucks through the isolation zone and crossed the high-voltage power grid through a heavily guarded entrance, including the strongest team on the surface. After walking a few steps across the high-voltage power grid, you can clearly feel that the air is moister and colder than outside. You can imagine how cold it will be at night. However, for those who are strong enough to awaken, this obvious change in climate and temperature is also psychological. I feel a little shaken, but my body can still bear it. Lin Qingfeng was very cautious. The team moved forward in a triangular formation. The tanks were at the rear of the formation. Crispy walked in the middle. The front of the formation was handed over to the four elements of doing. Outsiders, take the lead. Apart from the gloomy atmosphere here, it's not dangerous at all. Mo Yuan was nervous behind him for a while. When he saw that the mutated creatures were not coming to attack him, his back suddenly straightened a lot. The mutated creatures are not stupid. They will definitely not wander around the garrison. And strictly speaking, we haven't officially entered the wild animal world yet. Then where is this place? Mo Yuan couldn't help but ask. The map shows that this is the parking lot, and further ahead is the north gate. Look over there, Lin Qingfeng said while looking at the map. The map is the original tour map of Chimelong Wildlife World, so it's not a big problem to identify the location. Sure enough, a large open space appeared on the left and right sides, most of which were covered by messy vines. There were scrapped cars everywhere. It looked like a car cemetery that had been forgotten for decades. There are some damaged signs around, which can be vaguely identified as parking lot signs. Did you see it? These cars have been severely beaten, and most of the sunroofs have been penetrated. It must have been done by mutant creatures. As far as I know, mutated creatures are smarter than ordinary creatures. What are they doing playing with these cars? Do you think mutated creatures will use these cars as containers and lay eggs in them? Don't say it, it's really possible. Just look at it and you'll find out. Comma. Most of the first batch of teams were also around. They were very interested in these parking lots, but they were not stupid enough to go directly to check. Look at my fireball. Let's go. Here comes the sword. The one in front of you, let me give you a blow. Comma. Various long-range skills are used on the car cemetery, the attack power is not bad, and the scene is even more gorgeous. Mo Yuan looked at this scene with envy. Others' abilities are beautiful and practical, but look at his own. Give me a hard time. What a shame. 
The probing attack received no other feedback except its own movement. Everyone was relieved and rushed to the car graveyard to pick up the leak first. However, at this time, a sudden change occurred. There's a vibration. They were all the best among the awakened ones. They noticed something was wrong immediately, and someone yelled for their teammates in the car cemetery to get down quickly. But, it's too late. Hero, hero, hero. When the sound of breaking through the air continued to sound, everyone was horrified to find that the passage just now was scorched by fire, broken by stones, and blasted into slag by air cannons. The vines, which had no reaction at all, suddenly came to life. The sound of breaking through the air came from the violent attack of countless vines. Snapped. Ah, some people were caught off guard and died tragically on the spot, while others were caught by two vines and their bodies were torn into two pieces, with blood flying and the scene extremely bloody. Fortunately, these awakens were not slow to react and had good strength. After withstanding the first wave of sudden attacks, they were almost able to leave the car cemetery and return to their teammates. These vines are actually alive. Only then did the people who escaped the disaster scream in horror. Others who resisted taking advantage also looked at each other. They knew that Chimalong wildlife world was dangerous, but they didn't expect it to be so dangerous. They haven't officially entered the park yet. After the last person returned to a safe area, the vines swept away the corpses, and then quietly clung to the cars, looking harmless. If they hadn't seen it with their own eyes, no one would believe that these things devoured the lives of nine awakened people in just tens of seconds. The next scene was a bit noisy. What now, do we get rid of these vines? What are the key benefits of clearing them? I saw clearly at the car cemetery just now that there was nothing inside the car. The vines themselves don't have much value, right? It seems like these things can't climb out of the parking lot, so they have to get out of the way. I'm not interested anyway, let's go. Comma. Just when most people were about to retreat, someone jumped out to stop them. We can't leave. Seeing that everyone's eyes were attracted to him, Lin Qingfeng's voice became louder. If we leave immediately, the team that comes in behind will probably be booby-trapped and killed. After we come in here, we are all comrades in the same camp. You can't bear it do you see them being fooled? What's so unbearable about this? In today's world, aren't you used to life and death? This is what some people are saying, but they cannot say it out loud, because most of the awakened people were originally ordinary people who abided by the law, and now they still have a sense of justice. Therefore, Lin Qingfeng's suggestion was supported by the vast majority of people, and they began to clean up the vines. In order to reduce unnecessary losses, long-range attacks are used to clear the vines, and those who cannot attack remotely are responsible for vigilance. The strongest team on the bottom table took the lead. Lin Qingyuan and Han Fei stood side by side. The former activated the cold air to cover the large vines, causing them to freeze at a speed visible to the naked eye, and then detonated the ice. Once exploded, it is a piece, very efficient. Han Fei summoned a large ice blade to harvest the vines, which was domineering and silky, like cutting leeks. But to say who is the most efficient, it must be Wang Shasha. She reserved a parking lot by herself and walked in under the shocked eyes of many people. An even more shocking thing happened, those vines didn't react at all. Wang Shasha's eyes shot out a strange green light, covering the entire parking lot. After a while, the vines withered into ashes. On the other hand, this handful lowly licked her mouth and came back with satisfaction. There's a parking lot over there, you go ahead. Seeing Wang Shasha's fierceness, Yi Bai pointed to another parking lot that hadn't been dealt with yet. I can't do it, I'm already full. Wang Shasha waved her hand to refuse, and burped as she spoke. Seeing Yi Bai boredly watching everyone working on their stuff, she couldn't help but said, Why don't you, the strongest awakened person in the country, work? You should set an example. No, no, I'm just a beast turned awakened person who can throw rocks, but it's of no use. Yi Bai shook his head. These vines only stood out in large numbers, and their individual attack power was just that, and their defense power was a bit shabby. He really didn't like them. Let the little monsters go to others, I want to go up the mountain and hunt the tigers. The awakened beast, just throw stones, how can you have the nerve to say this? Wang Shasha looked at someone with disdain and said nothing. Not long after, Lin Qingyuan and Han Fei came back together. It wasn't that they couldn't continue working, 
but they had to preserve enough strength in this dangerous area. Hey, wife, you've worked hard, please take a rest. Yi Bai took out a mahogany chair with his backhand, placed it on the ground and motioned for Lin Qingyuan to sit down. Lin Qingyuan was already used to seeing Yi Bai changing things out of thin air from time to time, so she hummed and sat down to rest. Everyone has their own secrets, especially in this era, when all kinds of mysterious and strange things are not uncommon. Seeing Han Fei standing in a daze, she couldn't bear it, so she couldn't help but ask, are there any chairs? It's humid and cold here, and there's really no place to sit and rest. Have, Yi Bai nodded, can I also have a chair? Wang Shasha said quickly. Yi Bai nodded again, grabbed the two chairs casually, and placed them in front of Wang Shasha and Han Fei. Sit down, don't be polite to me. Yi Bai smiled. Looking at the two plastic chairs in front of them, Wang Shasha and Han Fei wanted to complain about something, but they were unable to complain. They could only lament that there are indeed differences between people. But having a chair is better than not having one, right? They sat down. Not to mention, sitting on a plastic chair in this environment is inexplicably comfortable. Aren't you going to take action? Lin Qingwan looked at Yi Bai in confusion. If she remembered correctly, this man was very keen on cutting down mutant creatures. Yeah, Yi Shen, you don't have a team spirit now. Wang Sha Sha teased. You'd better help me, otherwise my brother will nag you again. Lin Qingyuan said again. Okay, it's time to exercise. Seeing that his future wife had said this, Yi Bai stretched himself, stood up, and walked directly to the largest parking lot. He hasn't taken any action, and is actually observing. Now it seems that there is no big crisis here for the time being, and he can make a move. Soon, arriving at the so-called safe distance, the little Lei Yin Bo appeared silently in Yi Bai's hand. As for his long-range attacks, apart from turning into a demon ape and throwing things from a distance, the only thing left is his archery skills. Pulling the bow eight full, a flash of lightning left the string and hit the car graveyard hard. Boom, the terrifying power blew up a large area of scrapped cars, and dozens of vines clinging to them were blown to pieces, attracting many people's attention. Then they compared the destructive power of the thunder arrows between themselves and Yi Bai. Many people angry. Yi Shen, do you still say that you are an awakened beast? Yi Bai didn't care what others thought, he just kept drawing his bow, thundering arrows kept whizzing, and the large vines in front of him were quickly disappearing. Just banging and banging, he suddenly froze on the spot. No, with my explosion rate, I killed so many vines, why didn't the monster explosion prompt sound? This is so unscientific. No, no, Yi Shen, are you going to stop now? That's it, your cultivation methods don't seem to be very good at all. Seeing Yi Bai stop outputting, Wang Sha Sha found an opportunity to fight back, jumped up and stood on the mahogany chair and shouted. Wang Ran's mouth trembled when he saw this scene. Sometimes he was thinking, is this girl really a daughter of my old Wang family? Yi Bai was too lazy to pay attention to Wang Sha Sha's gesture, and flew into the sky. The Guangcheng Wushu Association emphasized that the safe height is within 100 meters, so he chose to fly up to 90 meters. This height could barely overlook the entire parking lot in Area A. From this perspective, it is not difficult to see that the entire parking lot in Area A was covered with vines. The awakened people worked so hard that they only cleared less than two-fifths of the area. Of course, this is not what Yi Bai wants to see. He used his vision to the extreme and quickly found the target. In the direction of the backlight, there was a cemetery shaking slowly. To be precise, it's squirming. Blocking the sun and looking again, the densely packed branches are intertwined to form a round shape, and the outside is covered by large green leaves. Below, countless whiskers are undulating like waves. These tendrils are exactly the same as the vines they are destroying. This is not a car cemetery, but a giant mutant plant. Didn't you say that the mutated plants here are magic medicine? Can such a magical medicine come into my pocket obediently just by calling it? This thing can scare trypophobia to death. Yi Bai smacked his tongue. This was the first time he had encountered such a, big, mutated creature. Recalling the popular science brochure issued by the Guangcheng Martial Arts Association, the prototype of this thing should be called Schwangenwein, which is a common wild vine that can be seen everywhere in the south. 
Looking at it from a distance, it wriggled very little, but its speed was really not slow. Just when Yi Bai was observing it, it had already run away, no, it had moved several hundred meters away. The cheerful vines that everyone was clearing seemed to be just worthless possessions that it had no time to take away. Not knowing what he would encounter ahead, Yi Bai no longer hesitated, took out the purple-black arrow made by his father, set the string on it, and drew the bow like a full moon. Although the base in Guangcheng is of little help to Yi Bai, these days he has relied on his powerful training talent, and has improved a lot in the big thunder sound breathing technique, and has reached the point where he can easily control the little thunder sound bow. Whoosh! Even the rays of the scorching sun could not conceal the presence of the purple light arrow, which cut through the sky in the astonished eyes of everyone and headed straight for the giant target 3,000 meters away. Boom! The arrows tore through numerous leaves and exploded on the branches of the mutated root penetrating vine. The powerful lightning power tore open a wound with a diameter of more than one meter. Even if the branches of the mutated root penetrating vine alone are 20 meters high, this wound is not too small. But this arrow seems to be of no use. Air, a, a, a. The mutated root penetrating vine made a cry like a baby, moved faster, and the wounds caused by the blast were recovering at a speed visible to the naked eye, and actually swallowed all his arrows. Excuse me. Yi Bai flew back to the ground with a dark face. He lost an arrow this time. He could finally see that he couldn't do anything to this mutant root penetrating vine. It seems that there are still many unknown things in this zoo, so we need to be more cautious. Since he couldn't deal with it and there was no threat for the time being, he had better not provoke him. You were blasting something just now, and you used all your energy to suck the milk. Back at the team resting place, Wang Shasha asked in a loud voice. On the ground, the view was blocked by buildings, hillsides, and woods, and they didn't notice the mutated root penetrating vines in broad daylight. We're just having fun, Yi Bai said angrily. Wang Shasa curled her lips. Hey, forget it if you don't say anything. Even if he didn't believe the truth, Yi Bai continued to watch the lively scene lazily. He didn't even bother to explain that these vines were probably in a dead vine state and would no longer attack people. Let the young people vent their energy. Soon, the entire Area A was cleared of vines, and each team continued on their adventure. Yi Bai didn't tell his teammates about the mutated root-piercing vine. This thing must be a boss-level existence, so there was no need to tell people about it to scare people. The strongest team on the surface held a small meeting, and finally Yi Bai decided to enter the battlefield through the nearest north gate. The reason was that it was closer to Baihu Mountain from the north gate. The distance from the parking lot in Zone A to the north gate is less than 500 meters, but the team walked for more than half an hour. They had no choice but to be so frightened by the car cemetery that everything they looked at felt dangerous. In the deep woods on both sides of the road, small mutated animals such as hares and pheasants also appeared from time to time. At first, no one paid much attention to them, and they just dealt with whoever got closer. But after Mo Yuan killed a mutated hare and exploded an awakening crystal core, the style of the painting changed. These gadgets also have awakening crystal nuclei in their bodies. Mo Yuan, be careful, I'll save you, just die. Don't move any of you, this mutant chicken is coming for me. You're a idiot if you don't move. I'm here to help you, dear brother. No, one and a half. Wow, it's such a big snake. Get out of the way. I, Wang Shasha, have decided this situation. Little girl, is this an earthworm? Comma. In an environment where the global monetary system must be upgraded, if you ask what is absolute hard currency, 100 out of 100 people will say that it must be the awakening crystal core. This thing not only serves as purchasing power, but is also a necessity for awakening talents and improving strength. More than 90% of awakened people enter Chimalong Wildlife World in order to awaken the crystal core. Therefore, even the four Duin ambassadors who came from a well-known family did not hold back and decisively attack the monsters. Originally, no matter how weak the mutated critters were, they were not something that the awakened one could handle alone. Didn't you see that the mutated crayfish that Yi Bai encountered during his class reunion almost wiped out the entire hotel? But the awakened people who can come here are the best among the awakened people in the country, so these mutated little animals are unlucky. People's joys and sorrows are not the same. Yi Bai, who was walking at the end of the team, 
only felt that this group of people was noisy, and there was also a difference between the awakened crystal core and the awakened crystal core. Although the official has yet to issue clear standards, the black market has already fined out a rough value system. The awakening crystal nuclei of these small mutated creatures are classified into the ranks of low-level awakening crystal nuclei. Let's put it this way, the awakening crystal core produced by a hundred mutant hairs is less valuable than the awakening crystal core of a mutant dog. I am the most powerful awakened person in the country. If I want to dig, I will dig out the awakening crystal cores of medium and large mutated creatures. GG. There was a sound of breaking wind behind him, and Yi Bai subconsciously turned his head to look, and saw a big mouse rushing towards him with scarlet eyes. So hard to think about. The extraordinary alloy knife appeared silently in his hand, and he chopped it off with a single motion. The light of the knife flashed. Squeak. The mutant rat only had time to let out a scream before it died on the spot. Kill a mutated rat, and you will get a piece of fine gold, and a basic mining technique, which has been stored in the reserve space. At the same time, there was a killing sound. Yi Bai silently opened the storage space and checked the harvest. Adamant gold. The main mineral material for making extraordinary weapons. One piece weighs a standard one kilogram. Yi Bai was a little shocked by the introduction of fine gold. Does this mean that by giving this piece of fine gold to his father, it would be possible to create extraordinary weapons? Awesome. Let's look at another harvest. Elementary mining technique. The auxiliary skill can be learned instantly and does not require practice. It seems more awesome. Yi Bai learned this basic mining technique without saying a word. As expected, there was a mark of a handheld hoe in the storage space. Checking it showed that you need to touch the mineral material with your hand to use the skill, and there was a bracket at the end showing 1 100. Is this still an upgradable skill? Yi Bai returned to reality with excited thoughts. Looking at the big rat on the ground, he swiped the alloy knife casually. His luck couldn't stop him, and there was an awakening crystal core in his head. Take it. Yi Bai took out the awakening crystal core and played with it, then threw it to Mo Yuan who was laughing bitterly at the side. Ah, how can this be so embarrassing? Hee <laughs> hee. Mo Yuan said he was embarrassed, but he quickly put the crystal core in his bag and put it away. Since he discovered that these small animals can explode the awakening crystal core, the next monsters will not be his fault. As soon as you enter, you will get two awakening crystal cores, and you will make a lot of money. At this time, Yi Bai looked at the scene of everyone fighting for monsters, and his heart began to hurt. He opened his mouth and shouted, Stop it. Yi Shen was still very dignified. Everyone stopped in response, but the few little animals who were stunned were stunned for a moment and quickly took the opportunity to run away. But a few lightning bolts ran faster than them. Kill a mutated rabbit and get one million yuan. Kill a mutated pheasant and get a piece of fine gold. Kill a mutated earthworm and get a basic mining technique. Kill a mutant rat and get a piece of fine gold. Comma. Listening to the pleasant notification sound, Yi Bai was in a good mood. After learning the elementary mining technique that was revealed, the brackets behind the skills became two one hundredths. Sure enough. Hey, Yi Shen, why don't you take me to grab monsters like this? Wang Shasha ran up to Yi Bai angrily and asked with her hands on her hips. That's right, Yi Shen, you don't follow martial ethics. Others were also unhappy and told people to stop but in the end, he just snatched everyone's monsters. Unacceptable. But I can't beat it. I'm not trying to grab monsters, I just feel like you're killing them too slowly and it's too disruptive to your journey, so I just want to help. Yi Bai explained with a smile, and before his teammates could say anything, he added. Also, your character is not as good as mine. The chance of me exploding the awakening crystal core is relatively high. After comprehensive consideration, I decided that I will contain these mutated animals that come out to attack, and you can be responsible for digging them out. You have a better character. Everyone's face twitched. How dare you, a monster hunter, say that you have a better character? Can you be thicker skinned? How can it be? However, when they dug out the mutated animal skull, they were stunned. Because the ten animals Yi Bai killed just now actually exploded five awakening crystal cores, the explosion rate reached 50%. You must know that they have been fighting for a long time, and it is roughly estimated that the explosion rate of the awakened crystal core is only about 20%. I think you just got lucky. Try again. 
Wang Shasha looked dissatisfied. Just give it a try and let you see what character is. Yi Bai smiled and pulled Wang Shasha aside and walked in front of the team alone. In addition to retaining the instincts of animals, the mutated animals also have somewhat improved IQs. At least they know the techniques of simple sneak attacks. For example, lone prey. So very quickly, Yi Bai ruthlessly killed 10 mutated animals that came for a sneak attack. He didn't even look at the corpses of the mutated animals, so his teammates behind him turned into ruthless core diggers. After some inventory, I got five more awakening crystal cores. What the hell? Wang Shasha muttered to herself. Faced with this fact, everyone was speechless and choked up. Yi Shen's character is too strong. Actually, it's good for us to dig cores. Han Fei said quietly. Yes, Yi Shen is indeed a good character. We all know this. The most important thing is that he is handsome and talented. I can also see that Yi Shen is a very genuine person, he is sincere and caring, and he is really first class as a friend. After everyone thought about it, they couldn't agree anymore, and they all spoke loudly. They worked so hard that they could only get three or two pieces. Based on Yi Bai's character, even if Yi Bai got the big one, the entire team would still make more money than if he had done it alone. The key is not tired. Sometimes, you still have to believe in metaphysics. The one in front was responsible for killing, and the one behind was responsible for cutting. Awakening crystal nuclei were collected one by one. The team walked back and forth in this dense forest path, like a ruthless assembly line. Later, Yi Bai got excited and wanted to fight into the dense forest with a knife, but he gave up after Wang Shasha's persuasion. This awakened person with a natural affinity for the dense forest said that there may be great horrors in the dense forest, these mutated small animals. Most likely they were forced to operate on the fringes. I don't know how long. It took so long for one or two to appear. Have they been cut down? Yi Bai asked expert Wang a little puzzled. Wang Shasha sniffed her nose and hummed. It's not that the chop is over, it's that the smell of blood here is too strong, and those mutated animals were too scared to come out. And we have to run away quickly, lest someone big come smelling the blood. Oh, let's go to the north gate. There will probably be mutated plants there. We haven't caught anything except those useless vines. The team proceeds along the established route. Yi Bai also returned to the middle of the team. He was a little tired, but looking at the more than 100 pieces of fine gold and 36 elementary mining techniques in the storage space, he felt it was worth it. You can see the north gate archway from a distance, but when you get up close, all the team members feel creepy. This north gate archway is not an archway at all, but is shaped like an archway by countless wasps. To put it more bluntly, these wasps regard the archway as their own nest. It was densely covered with wasps, most of which were about the size of a fist, and some were as big as an adult's head. There was a huge groove in the center of the archway, and you couldn't see what was inside. Yi Shen, why are you here so late? What should you do? Are you going to rush through or go around? Four hunting teams were waiting in front of the wasp archway. When they saw Yi Bai and his group, they hurriedly approached them and asked. They were all the team that originally planned to enter through the north gate. This arch spans the entire entrance, and unless you can fly, you have to pass under it. It's exciting to think about it. Have you tried it before? Yi Bai asked, looking at the archway. How dare we poke a wasp's nest, lest they swarm over and not even have a chance to hide. All the awakened ones shook their heads. Then why are you still here? Yi Bai asked bluntly. I'm not waiting for you. A team leader touched his head, looking very honest. How about going around? Those big ones are mutated wasps, there are too many of them. Lin Qingfang couldn't help but suggest. No, a determined voice. Yi Bai was naturally determined to take the north gate, but he was not the one who spoke. Instead, the four elements of Duin. Even a blind man could see this scene of unanimous voices. There must be something wrong with these four guys. Everyone's eyes turned to the four of them. Interesting, a few people were a little embarrassed. In the end, Wang Shasha was the more shameless one. After laughing, her face was solemn, listen to my quibbles first. This kind of hornet's nest can produce a special kind of royal jelly. It is a good thing. Taking it directly can strengthen your body. Body, develop your talents. Is it so outrageous? Everyone was shocked. That's it. Yi Bai always felt that Wang Shasha didn't explain clearly.
The Hanfu Loli nodded seriously. Yeah, that's it. Yi Bai also nodded. He was sure that the gang of four must have hidden something, or several. However, even the two effects of strengthening the body and developing talents are enough to make everyone present feel excited. If you don't take the treasure, you will be struck by lightning. Mo Yuan, who has trypophobia, looked at the wasp arch and found it pleasing to his eyes. I looked carefully and found that there are about 100 mutant wasps. If we cooperate, we still have a good chance of winning. Wang Ran, who had always been calm and sophisticated, also showed a little excitement at this time. Then let's cooperate. I agree, but how to distribute it is a problem. We are all our own people, just be fair. Comma. 100 mutated wasps, or mutated wasps whose specific strength is unknown. This is undoubtedly a huge danger, but no one present gave up. After all, no one who was afraid came in. The opinions were unified, and then tactics were discussed. It is obviously unrealistic to lure out the mutant wasps one by one. They must fight a large group directly, which will test everyone's cooperation. The five captains were about to discuss what to do, but were interrupted by the impatient Yi Bai. Don't split up the team, just encircle and suppress it on three sides. Our team is responsible for drawing aggro and dealing damage from the front, and the remaining four teams are on the two wings. Our team will share half of the resources obtained in the end, and you will share the remaining half equally. Yi Bai looked at the four captains, who agrees and who opposes. Well, the four captains looked at each other. Yi Shen made it clear that he would not negotiate the price. If they disagreed, they would probably stop playing. Without the strongest team on the surface, they would still be having fun. Agreed. Okay, let's do it. Following Yi Bai's order, the two wing teams were in position, ready to take action at any time. Zhang Tianming and Wang Ran are in the front to resist damage, Wang Shasha and Han Fei are on the second line of defense, Xiao Qingwan and Uncle Brother are on the third line of defense. Yi Bai also made arrangements for his own team responsible for the front. How should I put it, Ming Pai targets the four elements of Duin. What about you? Wang Shasha shouted angrily. She didn't argue that this was unreasonable, because there were only 14 of them in total. As long as the crispy skin could be output safely, it was a reasonable configuration. I'm a free agent. Yi Bai grinned. Do you still have any questions? If not, I'll start. Before Wang Shasha could respond, the small thunder bow in her hand was already fully drawn, and the lightning left the bow without even having to aim. Whoosh! On the archway 50 meters away, a mutated wasp was lying lazily. It suddenly felt something and spread its wings to take off as if in stress. But, it's already too late. Boom! After the light arrow pierced the body of the mutated wasp, it exploded in the wasp swarm, causing another death and injury. Kill a mutant wasp! get a piece of star silver, and a piece of refined royal jelly, which has been stored in the reserve space. Kill a wasp and get 100,000 yuan, which has been deposited into the reserve space. Kill a wasp and get a JK suit, which has been stored in the reserve space. Comma. When the beep sounded crazily, hundreds of thousands of wasps on the archway also went crazy. Buzz buzz. One, two, three. Half of the mutant wasps and ordinary wasps spread their wings and took off, gathering into a legion of wasps, with pairs of dark eyes staring at the invaders on the ground. Only then could everyone see that only the steel frame of the original archway was left, with dense honeycombs inlaid on it. Is the royal jelly Wang Shasha mentioned in these hives? Oh, we were only willing to send half of our troops if our home was bombed. We can't steal our homes now. This is not a bad thing. At least we don't have to face all the mutant wasps for the first time. I want to play close combat, so let's transform into Ultraman Tiga. The hatred is enough. If you keep a little distance, you won't destroy the royal jelly. Comma. The four elements of Duin at the front showed no sign of nervousness at all. Zhang Tianming, who was given the code name Terminator, directly transformed into the appearance of Ultraman Tiga, which was very cool. Yi Bai expressed envy of the mimetic metal. This talent is perfect for showing off. Wang Ran and the four men retreated slightly, and the Wasp Legion began to swoop down. Boo hoo hoo. Before they even get close, a black rain hits first. Wow, he can also attack from a distance, brother, save me. Wang Shasha shouted quickly. It's the black rain formed by bee stings. 
The wall of the forbidden army is up. Wang Ran calmly lifted it up in the air with both hands. Bang! An earth wall with a length and width of more than 10 meters rose from the ground, blocking Wang Ran and his friends behind him. Bang bang bang! The rain of bee stings was confiscated by the earth wall, and hundreds of swooping wasps were unable to stop the car and smashed themselves to pieces. At this time, Zhang Tianming jumped over the earth wall and rushed towards the wasp army single-handedly. In less than a few seconds, he suffered at least dozens of attacks, including the stings of mutated wasps. But even if he was stung by the mutant wasp stinger, it would only leave a hole the size of a fingernail in his body. His defense was broken, but he was not hurt yet. On the other hand, Zhang Tianming's ultra hand has hundreds of sharp blades growing out of it. He doesn't even have to stare at anyone, he can just wave around. The comb is like a hand, and it can take away the lives of several wasps with one wave, and all of them will die from dismemberment. Ha ha, I want to fight a thousand of them. Zhang Tianming's laughter was extremely wild. When Wang Shasha, who was hiding behind her brother, saw this, she couldn't suppress the urge to show off. She took something out of her pocket and threw it at the wasp army coming over the earth wall. Go, my big-headed doll. Wang Shasha's eyes burst out with green light, shining on the throne thing. She saw that the small thing instantly expanded hundreds of times, turning into something more than three meters high. Big head doll. Yi Bai looked at it curiously. Good guy, there are no other carvers like this. These dolls have big heads, bangs like dog gnaws, noses pointing up to the sky, and eyes that are still big and small. It's real, it must have been carved by Wang Shasha herself. It was ugly and frustrating, but this did not affect the big-headed doll's fighting ability at all. Two vines grew out of her palms, and she whipped them at the wasp army. I saw the wasp clattering to the ground and died peacefully. Even if the mutated wasp is hit once, it will be dizzy, and after a few more hits, the body will burst open. Covering the rain. Ice blade. Die. As the icy sound sounded, water molecules a hundred meters above condensed into water droplets, and then formed into pieces of sharp ice. Boo hoo hoo. The 100 meter fall potential is unrivaled. In the blink of an eye, a large gap appeared in the dense army of wasps. Seeing Han Fei kill everyone with one move, everyone present looked sideways and shocked. No wonder they all said that elemental talent is a terrifying talent starting from grade A. Now they realize the gold content in it. Area of effect spells are too perverted. The four elements of Duin are killing all around, which undoubtedly gives the people behind them unlimited confidence. The four teams of long-range attackers on the flanks take the lead in keeping up with the output to clear and harass. Of course, the frontal impact is undoubtedly the greatest. Protect my sister and kill me in close combat. Lin Qingfeng said nothing and jumped out of the earth wall created by Wang Ran. He took out the weapon behind his back with his backhand and slashed with the momentum. Golden light passed by, and a dozen wasps fell to pieces. Only then can you clearly see that he is holding a sword in his hand, shaped like a snake and shining with golden light. Sizzling. Buzz buzz. In the wasp army, eight mutated wasps made a harsh sound and led thousands of troops towards Lin Qingfeng. The treatment was almost the same as that of Zhang Tianming who was on the battlefield next door. Lin Qingfeng was not afraid at all. He swept across with his sword and spit out the golden sword energy, turning into countless spikes and whizzing away. Sizzling. The several mutated wasps that charged forward were caught off guard and were beaten to death by the dense spikes. Their cries were full of pain. Even the mutated wasps couldn't stand it, let alone the little brothers who hadn't evolved yet. They were swept by the rain of spikes and didn't even have time to scream, so they received the boxed lunch on the spot. My great uncle, Yi Bai couldn't help but praise him. His uncle was actually not weak at all. He seemed to be almost as good as Seraph without his penis. This sword is a bit like the golden snake sword in Jin Yang's novels. Why didn't he take it out when he fought with his uncle before? Yi Bai asked his wife next to him. Lin Qingwan rolled her eyes at him first, and then looked at the quiet voice on the battlefield. My brother doesn't want to live or die with you, so he doesn't have to use a weapon, and this sword was made after he became the vice president of the Yuncheng Martial Arts Association. The weapon awarded by the General Association, his precious tightness. Oh, Yi Bai suddenly realized. He also thought that this golden snake sword was not simple. 
His uncle was obviously stronger when he held it than when he was sparring with him. The most obvious thing was the patches of spikes, which were obviously stronger than when he was sparring with him, and the range was also smaller. Even bigger, even if the Lin family is the first family in Yunchang, it is unlikely that they can hide such good things. Feelings are sent by the work unit. That's okay. Behind the Wushu Association is the state. The state controls the production and manufacturing technology of weapons of the level of the Golden Snake Sword, which is very reasonable. However, compared with his extraordinary alloy series weapons, he felt that this Golden Snake Sword should still be inferior. Rise. Lin Qingyuan spat out her lips and teeth, and a transparent ice wall seven or eight meters long was pulled up in place to isolate the hornet from the incoming firepower. By the time the wasps got around, follow-up firepower had followed and eliminated them. In terms of practicality and scope, the ice wall created by Lin Qingyuan is slightly weaker than Wang Ran's earth wall. This shows how much progress she has made during this period. But not only did Lin Qingyuan feel no excitement, there was even a bit of worry between her eyebrows. Only then did she realize that she could not rely solely on the progress of her awakening. The key was the use of power. Her current strength is just a sliver behind Han Fei, but she can never do a large-scale attack like Han Fei, where it rains and turns into ice in the air. Her moves are all learned by herself, and she is now suitable for controlling the field. After all, the Lin family in Yuncheng is a quiet corner. At most, there is only one vice president of Yuncheng. Compared with those families that are truly ancient and have official connections and heritage, they are nothing. However, Yi Bai's background is even worse than that of the Lin family. He is probably a farmer for dozens of generations, but this person is very mysterious. He has a mysterious talent, a mysterious technique, and a mysterious skill. Even she doesn't know how many tricks the other party has hidden. It seems that even one person can rival the entire world. Thinking of this, Lin Qingwan glanced at Yi Bai beside her. Yi Bai happened to look over as well, and the two looked at each other. Yi Bai smiled slightly and winked at her. This unserious look made her feel very at ease. Comma. After working together to withstand the first round of the Wasp Army's charge, the next step will be much easier, just keep using skills. In just 20 minutes, the Hornets suffered heavy casualties. On the other hand, the humans only lost a few lives and had the absolute upper hand. Buzz buzz. Seeing that the dispatched partners were seriously injured, the wasp lying on the archway finally couldn't hold on any longer and took off towards the humans. The atmosphere at the scene became chilly again. Although they had eliminated at least nearly 20,000 wasps, the entire wasp army numbered at least 100,000. The tough battle has just begun. At this time, Yi Bai also took action, directly holding the extraordinary alloy knife, Yu Kong rushed into the wasp army. Close combat was the most lethal way. Call. A strong thunder light erupts in the darkness, and the thunder attribute damage caused by the big thunder sound breathing technique is simply the nemesis of these wasps. It does not even need a blade to touch it, and wherever the light touches it is destroyed. But a void was exposed, only to be filled in again by darkness. Yi Bai strolled leisurely, swiping his sword non-stop, and began to kill monsters. Blank spaces appear, blank spaces disappear, the repetition continues. At the same time, there is an emotionless sound that is repeated continuously. Kill a wasp and get a bottle of Lawfight 1982, which has been stored in the reserve space. Kill a wasp and get a basic mining technique, which has been stored in the reserve space. Kill a mutated wasp and obtain a portion of refined royal jelly, which has been stored in the reserve space. Kill a wasp, comma, refined royal jelly. In the ruthless notification sound, Yi Bai keenly captured the key words, but at this time he had no time to check one or two, because from his perspective, there were black hornets in all directions. Kill first and then talk. In such an environment, the subtle body technique could not work as well as it should. Soon, Yi Bai's body was covered with wasps, including two mutant wasps. Their attack methods are very simple. They can throw away the bee stinger from a distance and sting them in close combat. Not to mention ordinary awakened people, even Zhang Tianming with liquid metal body protection, well, he can carry it, but he can't carry it for too long. But Yi Bai looked completely calm, which shocked everyone who had been paying attention to him. Isn't it, isn't it? Without turning into a beast, this guy would be so thick-skinned. 
Why does his body feel more resistant than my liquid metal? This is unscientific. Zhang Tianming looked at the figure covered in wasps but still slashing like a god of murder, and expressed that he could not accept this fact at all. Sheer physical fitness cannot be so strong. Yi Bai should be wearing soft armor or something like that. Wang Ran looked at it intently for a while before making a judgment. Zhang Tianming felt that this judgment was not reliable, but compared to Yi Bai's body, which was comparable to his ability, this one was still relatively reliable. That's ridiculous, he is clearly from the third generation of poor peasants, how come he has so many treasures on his body? Even though he was a direct descendant of the Yingchuan Zhang family, he didn't have such good things. Wang Ran shook his head, he seems to be an anomaly. In short, try to be friends with him as much as possible. Hey, I suddenly want to see some guys provoke him. It must be interesting. Zhang Tianming suddenly laughed mischievously. Wang Ran smiled lightly. With Yi Bai's strong and fearless character, it is only a matter of time before he conflicts with them. Those who are arrogant need to receive good treatment. Yi Bai didn't know that someone was talking behind his back, but now he was going crazy. The stings of ordinary wasps couldn't break through Jinchen Baoyi's defense. The mutant wasps could barely do it, but they couldn't cause much damage for a while. Just, a little itchy. It wasn't until he felt a little heavy while holding the knife that he realized that these bee stings contained toxins. Although they could not cause fatal injuries, there were still side effects. Tiger Roaring Golden Bell Yi Bai gave himself another defensive buff without saying a word. Roar, the tiger roars, sizzling. The wasp on his body was frightened and instinctively wanted to run away, but as soon as he made a move, he was killed by the burst of golden light, and his body fell from the sky. The two mutated wasps were still confused in the air, but Yi Bai took them away with a knife. He got another piece of refined royal jelly. Although he didn't know what the use of this thing was yet, he had chopped down so many wasps and didn't even explode a few copies. It must be a good thing. Mutated wasps seem to have a much higher chance of exploding this thing. Spotting the nearest mutated wasp, Yi Bai raised his knife and rushed forward. The wasps he passed were knocked away by the protective golden bell, and those who were unlucky enough died on the spot. For Yi Bai, this was a one-sided massacre. The bloody battle is raging. This job is too tiring. Ultraman Tiga, the incarnation of Zhang Tianming, flashed the red light, cursed while holding his head, and ran back to the earth wall to rest. It's not that he has lost his fighting ability, but that most of his strength has been consumed. If there is any emergency if he continues to play, he will not have the strength to deal with it. I can only take a rest first. Like him, or this is human nature, almost no one here is really trying their best, at least they have three points left. Anyway, with Wang Ran, Lin Qingwan and other elemental mages controlling the field, there is not much danger if the rotation is done properly. But even so, six people lost their lives permanently. There were too many wasps, and even too many ants could kill an elephant. Those who took the opportunity to recover were basically looking at the battlefield in midair. There is the battlefield of Yi Shen. Looking at the figure who showed no sign of fatigue and was still swinging the sword as fast as lightning, they felt that the worldview of the awakened people that they had finally established was crumbling. Everyone is an awakened person, why can he be so fierce, slashing for 40 minutes without rest? Yi Shen has killed more than 24,000 wasps. There was a boring person who finally came up with this number based on the frequency and lethality of Yi Bai's sword swing, combined with the fighting time. Everyone gasped, this number is so terrifying. You must know that Yi Bai only took action in the second stage, which means that he alone could take down almost half of the wasp legion charging in the second stage. I also forgot to mention that he seems to have a special liking for mutant wasps. I took a look and killed 30 or 40 of them. The data emperor broke another shocking news. Everyone. No wonder it feels less stressful. Everyone, hold on, it's time to harvest soon. If you're injured, don't hold on and heal your injuries first. We have Yi Shen. I don't know who shouted something. Many people who fought with injuries thought it made sense and ran away. Three arrows fired in unison. Yi Bai's voice came from the air followed by three purple rays of light, traveling through a space of more than 100 meters, killing the three mutated wasps that were chasing the wounded into pieces. This was Yi Bai's response. Having him is enough. Everyone was excited and excited. 
Before, they thought Wang Ran and Lin Qingwan were very good at controlling the field. Now it seems that Yi Shen is not as awesome as Yi Shen. This is called controlling the whole field. In order to reduce unnecessary casualties, Yi Shen would rather work harder on his own. He attracted most of the firepower in the air alone. Many people with a good temperament were deeply moved at this time. That is to say, Yi Bai doesn't know what they are thinking, otherwise he would definitely wave his hands and say that this is unnecessary. I just want to kill more monsters and explode more things. It's really not as great as you think. Ho ho ho. A low roar came, making many people stunned. Yi Bai, who was in control of the whole scene, looked in one direction for the first time, and then couldn't help but narrow his eyes. He swung his knife to kill a group of wasps that were still fearless of death. He turned around and returned to the ground. He raised his head and looked at the archway. At this time, everyone realized that the roar came from above the archway, and they all looked up. At the same time, the remaining 20,000 wasps seemed to have received some instructions and no longer chased the humans on the ground. Instead, they spread their wings and returned to the archway, reorganizing themselves under the leadership of the mutated wasps. They did not continue to charge, as if they were waiting for something. Soon, the answer was revealed. From the edge of the giant groove on the archway, a claw of a black saxol was poked out, then two, then three. These claws are about the size of a human thigh, and they all come from the same creature. Roar, the creature poked its head out, finally revealing its true form. No surprises, a wasp head. But it brings surprises to everyone. It has a body as big as a big-headed doll, dozens of sets of symmetrical claws, and it can also spread three meters of black flesh wings to take off. The wings of a bat, the lower body of a centipede, and the head of a wasp. Is this a hybrid? Mo Yuan commented with a smile. But no one followed the joke, because they were all horrified by the sight of this hybrid, probably called a wasp. It was different from the creepy feeling when I saw the wasp archway for the first time. It would have been a shock, but now, it was pure fear. This is most likely a mutant queen bee. Its strength is unknown, but it is definitely more terrifying than any of us. In addition, I am sure that it is full of poison. You should avoid it. Wang Ran's face was extremely solemn. How about we make a strategic retreat? Zhang Tianming couldn't help but suggest. Han Fei and Wang Shasha nodded silently in agreement. Others don't know what a mutant queen means, and they, well, don't know how strong a mutant queen is. But this creature is a king-level mutated creature. No matter how weak the king-level mutant creature is, they cannot resist it. Even the four Duin ambassadors did not have the courage to face it, and everyone realized the seriousness of the matter, with extremely tangled expressions. As soon as a mutated queen bee appeared, they turned around and ran away. The problem is that now they have sacrificed several lives. The awakening crystal cores in the brains of the mutated wasps have not yet been dug out, and there are still things that can be obtained right away. Royal Jelly. Yi Shen, what do you think we should do? The captain of a team shouted. Everyone's eyes immediately fell on Yi Bai, and now it was time to see what the leader's attitude would be. I'll just farm the mutant queen, and I'll leave the rest to you. Yi Bai made a decision without even thinking about it. Run away, non-existent. This mutated queen bee is the strongest creature he has ever encountered so far, including humans. If this thing is going to be hacked to death, then why don't you give me a blast? The main thing is that he still has a certain degree of confidence in his own strength. If nothing else, there is no problem in saving his life. Yi Shen, don't try too hard. According to historical records, within the first year of global evolution, no human being could kill a king-level creature alone. We'd better run away, Wang Shasha quickly persuaded. Wang Ran glanced at his sister with a strange look on his face. Didn't he always quarrel with Yi Bai before? Why did he even reveal the secret in order to persuade him now? Others were stunned when they heard this. Historical records record, which historical record is this? Have you played time travel and rebirth? King-level creature, what kind of creature is it? Isn't it A, B, C and D? Reclassified again. Yi Bai was also confused by this question for a moment, but he soon put it behind him. He inserted the extraordinary alloy knife on the ground and raised it lightly with one hand. The small Lei Yin bow appeared silently in his hand, and he took out the arrow with the other hand. 
Ya, yeah, looking calmly at the mutated queen bee in the sky. I don't know whether your historical data is true or false. Even if it is true, then today, I, Yi Bai, will break this history. The words fell, and the bow was drawn like a full moon. Bang, thunder exploded, and the arrow turned into a violent meteor and flew away. The evolution of mutated creatures not only evolves in appearance and strength, but also increases in wisdom, and the wisdom of king-level creatures is generally comparable to elementary school students. Therefore, after the mutant queen came out of the nest, she did not rush to take action. Instead, she inspected the two-legged insects on the ground from the air. Whenever she caught the fearful eyes and movements of these two-legged insects, she would launch a thunderous strike. Very good, he saw these two-legged insects are afraid. Therefore, the mutant queen didn't expect that these two-legged insects would take the lead. When the lightning struck directly at the door, a look of surprise appeared on her ugly face. Then, boom, the king-level creature that seemed invincible in the eyes of Wang Ran and others fell down, and the power of the arrow explosion directly tore apart the two mutated wasps next to the mutated queen, as well as hundreds of unmutated wasps. Boom, roar, before the rising smoke and dust dissipated, the mutant queen turned over like a carp, her dark eyes turned scarlet, and she roared and ran towards Yi Bai. The speed at which dozens of claws exploded was comparable to that of a high-speed train. Stay away from me, Yi Bai, however, was completely fearless. He hung the small thunder bow on his arm, pulled out the extraordinary alloy knife and faced it. He was not reckless, and gave himself the buff of the tiger's roaring golden bell in advance. Seeing that the weak two-legged beast still had the guts to offend, the mutant queen became furious again. She opened her mouth and sprayed a mouthful of saliva. Yi Bai did not expect that the mutant queen was so unhygienic, so she twisted her body to the limit and managed to avoid it. The large pool of saliva fell on the ground, instantly corroding a large pit that could bury a person, and the pit was still smoking. Yi Bai saw this scene out of the corner of his eye, and his face trembled. Sulfuric acid was too weak compared to this thing. But there was no time to shock him, because the mutant queen had already opened her mouth to bite. Yi Bai didn't dare to be careless, and used the subtle body technique to its extreme. With another miraculous movement, he dodged the lightning bite, and then turned sideways to avoid the claw that was heading straight for his head. However, there was still no breathing space, and the mutant queen was attacking again. The mutant queen is huge, but her movements are very agile. She has many key attack methods, including but not limited to spitting, biting, wing flapping, claw scratching, bee sting. A proper fighting gangster. Everyone who obeyed and avoided felt their scalps numb. They asked themselves that after facing the mutated peak, they would definitely not be able to complete a process, but Yibai had gone through several processes and it still didn't matter. This body technique is so beautiful. Originally, according to the plan, they had to be responsible for cleaning up the remaining wasp army, but when they saw Yibai and the mutant queen engaged in a ground battle, they didn't even have a chance to take action and could only watch from a distance. The wasp legion seemed not to have received the order from the mutant queen, and was still flapping its wings and hovering in the air, with no intention of attacking. As a result, the situation became that of Yi Bai single-handedly brushing the mutated queen. You're the only one with a temper, right? Give me a knife. After going through several processes, Yi Bai finally found an opportunity, jumped up and slashed the mutant queen on the back. Kang, under the blade, a spark flew up. Yi Bai's eyes shrank. The extraordinary alloy knife combined with his 80% strength strike was still unable to break through the defense behind the mutant peak. You must know that during his time in the Guangcheng Martial Arts Association, he had perfected the Great Thunder sound breathing technique, and his strength was not the same as when he killed the explosive seraph. To be honest, Yi Bai didn't even know how strong he was because he had no reference. Is this the value of a king-level creature? It's not an exaggeration. Seeing the mutant queen turned around in pain, with a fist-sized wound on her face from an arrow and still bleeding gray-green blood, Yi Bai grinned, look behind you. Your mother is here. Roar. After the mutant peak, she naturally ignored him and pounced on Yi Bai again. Two shadows, one large and one small, were fighting together again, so fast that the eyes of the melon eaters in the distance could not keep up. Under the ultimate subtle body technique, the mutant peak queen was a target for Yi Bai. At best, it was a dangerous target. 
the blade of the extraordinary alloy knife kept falling on every corner of the target. Being unable to break through the defense does not mean that the mutant queen is not in pain. On the contrary, the mutant queen roars in pain again and again, and her attacks become more and more crazy. It's just that it's not very useful. Yi Bai's movements are becoming more and more weird, and his fighting style is becoming more and more flexible. He can also jump out of the battle circle from time to time and shoot an arrow unexpectedly to the mutant peak queen. Facing the attack of a large amount of poisonous saliva, he suddenly transformed into a huge metal shield and hid behind the shield. What is the most important thing about defeating boss alone? Veteran players will tell you that the most important thing is pulling. Yi Bai took the pulling to the extreme. The mutated Queen Bee had good martial arts skills, but she was stunned by his pulling. Expert players will also add that in addition to pulling, absolute patience is also required. I wear diapers before I just brush booze, okay. Yi Bai also had enough patience, he pulled so hard that even the onlookers around him were tired of watching. Finally, he got his chance. The mutated Queen Bee that was knocked over jumped up as fast as possible, but the two-legged beast was nowhere to be seen. I'm here, the mutated queen turned her head, her pupils reflecting the enlarging cold blade. Kick, but before it had time to react, there was no blockage, and all the blades were submerged. Yi Bai finally showed a smile. He was so stupid that he finally got into his soul. Roar, the mutated queen let out a shrill scream, not caring about killing the hateful two-legged beast, and spread her wings to fly into the sky. Yi Bai, who was sitting on the back of the mutant queen, was caught off guard and was knocked to the ground. But he reacted very quickly. When he jumped up and stood still, he had already set up the bow with his left hand and held three arrows with a cold luster in his right hand. Three arrows shot up. Is this why you won't play if you don't want to? Die. Before he finished speaking, there was a whooshing sound. It sounded like one sound, but in fact it was three sounds in unison. Three arrows fired in unison. Three rays of lightning shot straight into the sky, accurately hitting the mutated queen bee's soft belly that was exposed due to her hasty escape. Roar. The beast's roar resounded throughout the world again, but it only lasted for a few seconds and then stopped abruptly. The huge shadow fell to the ground, splashing dust all over the sky, and also splashing huge waves in everyone's heart lake. King level creature, mutated queen bee, die. I, am I reading fake historical data? Wang Sha Sha stared blankly at the motionless corpse of the mutated Queen Bee. Wang Ran shook his head gently. The historical data should be true, but Yi Bai, he created history. If he breaks the previous record, is he going to heaven? I don't know if he can go to heaven, but we who were in the same era as him are too unlucky, right? After coming back to his senses slightly, the proud Duin ambassadors had a bitter look on their faces. They were supposed to reflect an era but now they were suppressed by this anomaly and couldn't hold their heads up. Buzz buzz. Once the mutated queen died, the remaining wasp legions did not run away, but charged toward humans like crazy. However, biological instinct made them subconsciously avoid the lonely figure. Yi Shen has killed the mutant queen, it's our turn, let's kill. The human team is also crazy, it's she crazy. Once the mutant queen dies, they will definitely win. Outside the north gate archway, chaos broke out again. However, this did not affect Yi Bai, because no creature came to harass him. This was good news, because his last bit of strength was exhausted with the three arrows. Fortunately, Dalayan's breathing method was abnormal enough. After standing quietly for a while, his strength recovered by 20 to 30 percent, which was enough for him to deal with emergencies. He paused the big thunder breathing technique and glanced at the chaotic side. He saw that his side had the upper hand and it wouldn't take long for the wasps to be cleared away. What are you waiting for? Open storage space. At the moment when the mutated queen bee died, the beep played for more than a minute, which showed how many items this king-level creature exploded. However, among so many items, only three items caught Yi Bai's eye. The first is ten parts of king-level refined royal jelly. Royal jelly extracted from mutated queen bees is a rare raw material for refining high-grade elixirs. Oral administration of the pure jelly can cleanse the marrow and cut tendons, restore strength, and increase the speed of practice. The super-enhanced version of refined royal jelly. If I had known that taking a bite of this thing would restore my strength, why would I pretend to be a lonely master? 
Yi Bai said that he had miscalculated. The second is a Queen Bee Spirit Pearl, which can be used to awaken the full level poison talent. The less the introduction, the bigger the deal. It can turn people into top level talent awakeners, and it is also a poison talent that is rarer than elemental talent. This is equivalent to creating a super genius out of thin air. Yi Bai immediately thought of Mo Yuan. If he ate this thing, wouldn't he be good brothers for the rest of his life? Forget it, he doesn't deserve it. Well, Mo Yuan's talent is not bad, just help him continue to dig and he will be able to fight. Change the talent, and it is also the poison talent in the direction of Lao Yinbi, which is inappropriate and inappropriate. Mainly my good brother is the character of Wei Guangzhong, okay. The Queen Bee's Ganoderm Elucidum is of infinite value, but he by himself cannot use it. Not to mention the fact that he has used all his talents, even if he has the ability to use poison, it will not greatly improve his actual combat power. At most, it can be regarded as a means of self-defense. The third primary elixir is a scripture for refining primary elixirs. It is an auxiliary skill that can be mastered immediately after learning without the need for practice. It still can't improve its strength, but Yi Bai believes that if this thing gets out, it will probably cause the third global war. Of course, Yi Bai would definitely not let the Junior Alchemy Sutra go out, let alone hand it over to the country. He still understood the reason why it was a crime to possess a jade. Overall, it's really good to kill king level creatures. Correct. Yi Bai thought of something, exited the storage space, and looked at the body of the huge mutated queen bee. He walked over and pulled out the extraordinary alloy knife. He looked at the blade and saw that the blade was a little painful. This pull had pulled the mutated queen to death, but the knife was also scrapped. The blade was densely covered with small gaps, and the tip of the blade was corroded. Even if it could still be used, it wouldn't be as handy as before. There is an extraordinary alloy hammer in the storage space that can be used as a substitute weapon, but holding a hammer always feels less satisfying than cutting with a knife. It seems that if we want to kill more mutated creatures, it would be better to kill a few more king-level creatures. We will definitely be able to use a better knife. Speaking of which, the weapons of the Extraordinary Alloy series are not enough to deal with king-level creatures. Thinking in his mind, Yi Bai slashed open the mutated Queen Bee's head with a knife. As expected, there was an awakening crystal core lying inside. He dug it out and looked at it in his hand. The size was similar to the awakening crystal core he had seen before, but there was a mist inside the mutant queen's awakening crystal core. The fog is still dynamic and very strange. Yi Shen, are you willing to transfer the crystal core of this mutated queen bee? Yi Bai turned around and saw Wang Ran and four others walking towards them. The wasps over there were almost strangled. As he got closer, Wang Ran took a closer look at the king-level awakening crystal core in Yi Bai's hand, and his eyes flashed with uncontrollable excitement. Not to mention the other three, they can hardly move their eyes away. You want it? Yi Bai asked with a smile. Wang Ran said seriously. I want it, but I can't afford it, but I can make a deal to you on behalf of the Wang family. Yi Shen, if you are willing to give up your love, my Zhang family also wants to buy it. Zhang Tianming said quickly. Han Fei hesitated for a moment and then said, My Han family also wants to buy it. Yi Shen, if you have any conditions, just ask for it. I promise not to let you suffer. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.